Um, I got some bad news for you. If you weren't here last night, we've had a a real. <laughs> oh my god, it's so bad. It's the worst thing. We've had to death march to a new map. The toxic fallout. We ran out of food. We were not prepared. Oh man. This is where we this is where he ended last night. This is the last thing that we did. What a damn mess. We brought some supplies and stuff with us. We brought all the animals and stuff too. Um we just need to really um Holy crap. We just we just really need to start getting some shelter and stuff set up, right? Very mucho importante. Wait for the uh wait for the toxic fallout to leave. Oh, so annoying. So annoying. What's this? This is marshy soil. At a hundred percent it's a hundred percent fertile. Is marshy soil good for growing stuff on? I'm gonna assume yeah it is. Structure? Looks like we're we're making a structure out of wood. Okay. Uh, let's get a door in here as well. We just need to get have a, a nice little. Oh, fuck. We can't build this here. We can't build this here. <laughs> what am I doing? Oh, what am I doing? Orders. Let's cancel all of all of these jobs. Let's deconstruct all this stuff too. God, that went up quick. Yes, with it. I know it's not that. Uh, it's not that cold over here, is it? It's not that cold. Do 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 do. Okay, let's do a structure out of wood. Let's do it over here. We'll have to deconstruct this mechanoid detritus. Alright. Designer 3K is having a massive tantrum. What's the weather like here? 25 degrees. Oh my god. These guys are all losing their minds. It's so annoying, isn't it? All right, zone. We're gonna need a dumping. Bear has flown into a murderous rage. Oh no! <laughs> uh, that's not good. What? What? What here? What here signifies that this man is ever capable of a murderous rage? He's not like an aggressive person. Why the murderous rage? That's a bit wild, isn't it? Okay, back here. Let's do important, and then let's... We might die, actually. I don't think this is going to get... I don't think this is going to go very well. He's a, he's a melee boy as well, isn't he? We might have to get Sappy in to try to arrest him. Hopefully not kill him. Here he comes. Oh god, he's gonna kill designer 3Ks and he fucking hell. I think we're about to lose another colonist here. Um, we have nowhere to uh, to put this guy if we arrest him. And if we arrest him, he leaves the, the colony temporarily as well, right? When you start a new colony, you get a low ex expectations mood buff, but if you do this, you don't. Yeah, I know. Now they all have high expectations, right? So it's just going to be fucking break after break after break. All right, Sappy. Oh, 
Oh shit. Intercept. You got him. Nice. Okay. Is he almost dead? Uh, no, he's just bruised and cracked and stuff. He'll probably be okay. All right, let's make some furniture. Let's get some beds going. How many beds do I need? More than eight? I need uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. I need 17 beds. I can't believe it. How has this happened? How do we have this many colonists? It's, it, it's insane. Uh, okay, four... Eight, twelve, and then let's get uh, sixteen, and then what do we need? Seventeen. Okay, and then we'll get some end tables in here too, right? It's gonna be so cramped in here. Some of these are gonna have to be for um, medical as well, right? Poor bear is just out here. He's dying. Well, at least my guys can work pretty fast, right? Medical. Um, here, Yun Yun. You can rescue him. Okay, good. The animals are starving. They shouldn't be, though. They should have access to stuff, right? Furniture. Let's get a torch lamp in here. Let's also get a temperature passive cooler. Try to keep it somewhat cooled down in here. Melly is in a, in a daze. While all this is happening, how's the... How's the toxic fallout doing over here? You're doing great, Dad. Oh man, I wish we could go back. It's still it's still active. It is still active, sadly, the toxic fallout. All right. Zone growing zone. We're going to need Where's the best uh Place blueprints, toggle pollution overlay, temperature, fertility. So this uh, is 100% fertile. This is 70%. Soil and marshy soil. What's the difference between soil and marshy soil? They're both 100% fertility. Does, it, does that mean that that's the fastest you can get? One has marshy in the name. Rich soil is the fastest. Oh, rich soil has 140. So this is... Ah, oh, I see. There's rich soil here. Holy crap, there's so much of it up there. All right. All right, we need to get some rice grown very fast. Rich soil is going to be the way to do it. Allow sowing rice plants. It's a bit over here. It's a, it's a little bit far from the base. We could have actually just set up the base down here, I think, instead. Now they got this big old trek. Um, we need to start storing some of this stuff in here, actually. Let me just go structure wooden wall. Let's get set up uh, closer to this, right? Makes more sense. Uh, 
Um, we'll just lose one there. That's fine. Oh my god. Orders. Just chop as much wood as you can. We need loads. Everybody's sleeping. Everybody's so pissed off as well. Do, 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 do. There's a lot of starvation happening. <sighs> what is this? Bush lily. Oh, there's berry bushes dotted around. People might just need to forage for berries for the time being. Rolete is collapsed. Extreme malnutrition. Ah, fuck. I think we're dead. I don't think I can get food made quick enough. For all these people. It's too many people, right? Fucking toxic fallout is just such a fucking piece of shit, isn't it? It's got that's gotta be one of the most anti-fun events in the whole game, right? Oh here you go. Sorry about your twenty plus hours of working on your colony. Oh Mr. Coffee Bean's having a tantrum now too. Get some shelves in here. Eat the huskies. The worst of the toxic fallout is settled? Come on. Holy crap. Can it be done? We're sending everyone back. Where's all the stuff? There's no way we used up all of those components and stuff. Where are, where where are they all? Is it oh cuz they're not on uh, shelves. We got to get some stockpiles. Oh, that's so fucking annoying. Is it cu it's cuz we settled here, right? That's why. Foot sandwich is catatonic. Mr. Fibble42 is having a... T These people are all just losing their minds. Melly's in a daze. Bo died. From malnutrition. Ah, we're dead. Rolete's dead. Yeah. Well, was that run number four? Done. Fuck. Strive to survive commitment mode. I think we'll do Randy again. I think it was a bit better than uh, Cassandra Classic. So I guess we just need to replan how we farm. We need to do it in such a way where we can quickly put roofs over silos and uh, and put lights on for shit like that, right? Volcanic winter and toxic fallout. Allow tool is really handy. Oh yeah, before we start, let's get that. Um, I'm I'm not against getting that one with the little um, it, they look like supermarket freezers that you can put meals in. It's like a refrigerated shelf for meals. I'm not I'm not against grabbing that one as well. Rim fridge. I f I I hate the whole storing your meals in the in the production freezer and everybody going in there just to get stuff 
I'd rather I think I think Rimbridge is is kind of realistic. I mean, you're building charge rifles and stuff and you don't have a fridge. I'll get that one too. Mods. Get mods from the workshop. So what's the what's the what's the, what is it? Allow tool? Allow tool. A set of tools to make your life on the rim a bit easier. Easily forbid and unforbid items. Select similar things. Have things hold urgently and affect the entire map with powerful new tool extensions. That's the one, yeah? Allow tool. Okay, allow tool. Rim fridge. Uh, which one do I want? Rim fridge updated? Rim fridge updated for the one for one point four. Okay, rim fridge. Um, did I say there was anything else that we wanted to add last time? Combat extended. I got replaced things already. We got the smart thing already. Replace, we got ceiling lights. Ceiling lights. Adds two hanging ceiling lamps. Out of sight, bright light. Ceiling grow lamp outputs full spectrum light for ultimate plant nutritional needs. So you can get a ceiling um, plant one as well. Is this is this uh, the one which allows Collins to auto pick up weapons again after recovering? I think we have that. Explosive bathroom mod is pretty great. <laughs> Smart construction and smarter deconstruction. Ceiling light. Overhead ceiling light. Adds two hanging ceiling lamps. Out of sight bright light. Ceiling lights vanilla edition. More vanilla in nature. Requires more power and the light ranges are similar to vanilla values. I think I'll just leave this one. I think wall lights for now is fine. Okay, well, we got those two mods. Let's just stick with that for now. Allow tool. And rim fridge updated. Okay. Oh, I can't believe it, man. I mean, <laughs> it sucks, but... We did have a lot of shitters in that colony, and we didn't we didn't we didn't have anybody nearly trained up enough to to fight stuff, and we just weren't ready for any of those big events either. We'll have to be more ready this time. Hydroponics is needed. Yeah, I know. Close. New colony. Next. Strive to survive. Commitment mode. Randy random. Our seed is called roulette. Alright. We have to try to beat the game sort of doing the default way before we do any of the other ones, right? This is a, a hostile faction, minus 80. Minus 80. These guys, the purple can me, are not too bad. Terrain, year-round growing. Maybe we just nestle in here. Large hills, slate and sandstone, year-round growing. It's got caves, though. Small hills, mountainous caves 
northern coast and caves eastern coast what does eastern coast do this is year round large hills year round growing we're like right by the coast Oh, it's a tropical rainforest. Oh, yeah, you're right. I don't really want to be in a tropical rainforest. There's a swamp here. Temperate forest. Ease. Ease are neutral. There's a bunch of empire settlements here. Rackham Pit and Kubelur are all close by. Um, growing period, 40 out of 60. Can get cold. Okay, we're year round over here. Not quite there or there. This is year round, but it's got caves. This is year round. Sandstone and marble. It's mountainous. It has no nearby pollution. Average temperature is 16.8 degrees. Okay, let's go with this. We're close enough to people that we can trade with, right? These guys are a little bit further, but these guys are pretty close. Just got to go through the mountains. Although, is this impassable mountain? So we'd want to nestle ourselves more this side if we wanted to trade with ease, right? Which would then put us on a path with all of this stuff too and then we could get up to the empire spots if we need to all right sure so we're saying year-round mountainous that's pretty good right we just can we, we're close to the road get up onto the road and away we go limestone limestone slate and granite year-round 15.9 degrees. Okay, perfect. Let's set up here. We'll create a custom fluid one again. Everybody's favorite. Let's randomize. And let's go... Um, let's try one of these this time. Individualist, symbol burning, honorable... This uh, prevents slavery. Each person is a free individual with the right to their own ideas and decisions. Nobody should be made to conform. It's got low impact. Or we could go for this one. Pro proselytizer. Pro pros prosele proselytizer. Or we could just go high life. Drug use essential. Smoke leaf circle. Plants and specialists. Drug use prohibited. Prevents precepts. Prohibited drug use. Medical only. Medical or social only. Agreeing traits. Chemical interest and chemical fascination. New buildables, the auto bong and the mine bend carpet. We'll just uh, we'll just get into we'll we'll just get into the weed business again. Smoke leaf does keep killing injured dudes. Yeah, please not weed again. What do you want to do, rancher? Then raising animals the right way, raising plants to eat is not. Required precepts: ranching central. Flesh purity. The human body should not be debased. Transhumanist. Blood feeding. Human primacy. Bonding is disapproved. Production specialist. Prevents precepts. Precepts. Pre-snips. Killing innocent animals. Mining. Cutting trees. This is a medium impact as well. Do some cannibals? No, I don't want to do cannibals. Production specialist is powerful. You want to try human primacy for once then? Nova faith. Cult of Tadilas. The cult of humanity. Humanitism. Tadilasism. Theohumanitism. The path of spiritualism. Mortal creed. Okay, let's go for mortal creed this time. Current points, none. You want to add a um, a techist style as well, straight from the start. Go for like a cool high tech thing.
We can put slavery uh, acceptable, apparently, even though it said that we couldn't. Oh no, this one wasn't this the one the one against slavery, right? This one was fine. Free love. Normal research. Bonding disapproved. To emotionally bond with a lower being is a shameful act. Okay, so we can't bond with animals. But does that does that mean we can't train them? Okay, let's accept slavery. Let's accept organ use. You can still train them. You, they just don't get attached to them. It actually makes it easier to sell them then, right? Okay. So we have a priest of humanity, a divine person, a makator. We got the hominid requiem, sacrifice of spiritism, it's an animal sacrifice. And then we got Tadila's Advent, a social festival. Pew and a human chancel. The hominid horn and the theofragment are our relics. What about if we added like something really cool, like a like a gun? How about we add a the Theo keepsake. It's a handgun. It's like getting Rashala's gun in uh, Tarkov. Okay. Tattoos. Uh, body tattoos. Punk. Normal. Seven in use. Okay. Mortal Creed. Mortal Creed. The human horn. Mortal Creed is a religion devoted to the band Creed, yeah. Tilix, Fenny, Darius, Hado, and Henus. Tadalus and Jay. Lunanos and Hatuart. Seaman, let. We can just keep doing this. Shator and Finiton. An advent of Shator, Shator's immolation, and a human funeral. All right, cool. Let's go with this. Uh, we'll try it out. Sure. Mortal Creed. Okay, we do need. I don't think we want to start with state engineer. Here is pretty good, actual, actually crafting, intellectual, and medical. The bit of construction. Childhood nerd, adulthood state engineer. Traits annoying voice has a particularly grating nasal quality to it and he tends to talk in bark garbled phrases this predisposes others to dislike him if he has an annoying voice will people try to socially fight him all the time he's incapable of social Sonia is a space marine a beautiful space marine who has a stab scar on her left hand, shooting, melee, mining, and crafting. Okay, Sonia Sonia's a keeper for sure. We've got a starfighter pilot here who has 16 shooting. Holy crap. That's insane. 16 shooting to start with. Yeah, 81 years old, I know. 10 intellectual as well. Incapable of caring. Yeah. Brawler, misogynist, iron willed. We got a pop idol here who's incapable of like every piece of work you can imagine. We got a gigolo who will not do dumb labor or skilled labor. We got Tess, a scout who's fast walker but abrasive and lazy. Squirrel's an engineered pilot who's very neurotic, a fast learner, but will not do dumb labor. And uh, a military officer. Lots of guys with shooting, huh? Incapable of carrying in animals? That's fine. 
Not too many people with uh, with social skills, though, right? Sonia, no social. This guy as well. I think we'll probably take Sonia, Jet. We need. We do need some cooking and plants. You're right. Yeah. So far, we have nobody with cooking. Nobody with plants. Flow? Construction, mining, cooking, plants, and crafting? Incapable of violence, though. <coughs> A jealous, wimpy, hard worker. And now we don't have any medical. Jet is incapable of medical. Sonia has some medical skill. And Mendoza here has some medical skill as well. <coughs> we do need a, uh, a social person, yeah. If I go back, will it just... Yeah, it redoes everybody. Shooting. Animals. Melee. Quick sleeper. Ace tick. This is the one where they don't want to have a nice room. This one has cooking and medical. Crafting mining, but is incapable of violence. It's not necessarily a bad thing. Kind and incapable of violence. Okay, let's keep chambers then. We have somebody here who's... Quick sleeper, ace tick, incapable of intellectual artistic, but has shooting and melee. So Ram, not bad. Ram would be a good hunter, at least, and then is able to do backup cooking. So we'd have two people with a flair for cooking. I don't think we take Nanami. Great memory, chemical interest, and neurotic. Fast learner, incapable of social. So that has that gives us mining, planting, animals, crafting, and intellectual. So we'd have no social going in with the, with this team. Chambers has social two, which potentially could work on. And we have nobody who can do construction either. Industrial orphan who's psychically dull and lazy. Incapable of violence, caring, or social. Too smart. Abrasive. Lazy. All right, well, they're just going to have to learn how to do construction. We're not going in with anybody with a construction flat. Hopefully, we pick somebody up with one. We need the religion. They're all terrible. I know. They are literally... Every single one of these is terrible, but... I could I could sit here for the entire stream and try to find the perfect... The perfect pawns, but it, it just seems like... Why, why bother playing the game? It's just going to be botch, 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 botch. Not perfect, but just ideal. Okay, well, I mean, it's, it's just semantics, right? Like, If we have this abrasive person... And somebody who dislikes and distrusts men, they're going to be fighting all the time. All the damn time. Um, what about, what, what about lazy? Global work speed minus 20? Chambers? Kind but incapable of violence? Ah, oh, fuck it. Let's just do another one. Jesus Christ. Okay, this guy's got construction, plants, and animals, but he's incapable of firefighting, and he has an annoying voice, but he, and he's delicate, and has, uh, iron, iron will, but no combat stats.
He's pretty sweet. We have construction and mining. Cannibal and psychically dull. We have great memory and beautiful, but incapable of caring, social, and hauling. Velma is a misandrous, bloodless recluse. He's 14 years old and has good shooting and and animals. 20 artistic? Who is that? This one. Yeah, 20 artistic on Barry. Caring, social, and hauling. The lack of is so annoying. You wouldn't mind getting this guy like later, but to start with, it'd be a bit rough, right? So Velma could potentially be our hunter. This guy can do planting, construction, and he's got medical as well. Um, William the Tinkerer can do crafting, construction. What do we lack now? We lack cooking and intellectual. 12 cooking with no intellectual. We don't have to... This is a, a Misandrous Gourmand who's incapable of social as well. Explosives expert. Maybe we take the housewife, 45 years old. And that leaves us with skills in pretty much everything except intellectual. You're mixing up with the wimp. Delicate means they take extra damage from attacks. Chara and Jonah are lovers. Yeah, I know, but Jonah... Well, I mean, Jonah can do, like, a bunch of stuff. He's a cannibalist... He's a cannibal misogynist. Incapable dumb laborer. Fuck, I think we just go like this, and then we'll just assign these guys different names when we get in as well, right? Let's just go like this and just fucking see how we go. A Trump voter. Maybe. All right, I'll give I'll use the Twitch thing to uh, to get some uh, other names once we're in. All right, nice. Velma, Fulton, and Chara soon to be. Um, let's see. Fulton, Velma, Chara. NyQuil 89, Ramsey 8, and Shady Lurk. Shady Lurk. Alright. Wow, look at all the fertile soil over here. There's a whole bunch of it. It's quite nice, isn't it? There's a bunch up here, too. These two areas are passable. A lot of infestation potential. God, yeah. I mean, maybe we maybe we just embrace the infestation and start building into the, um, into the mountains, like, straight away. Be a little bit easier, right? There's like all this space back here. Make a nice defensible colony. We could do. We would have to. Um, we would. We we'd be able to have some outdoor farms. There's a vent here too, really close to all these farms. Do 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 do. Yabba dabba do. It's just um. It's annoying being close to the edge of the map, right? Because you can get caught. You can get caught off guard. Being so close to the edge, you get raided, and you just don't have time to get people back indoors or whatever. Half and half. No housing the mountain, so everyone can still not die in their sleep. Yeah, potentially. 
I think we set up in here. Let's just set up in here, and then we've got the farms and stuff, and then we can potentially just put a wall across here, and then, you know, kill people, like, in this area. And then we'd be able to kill them coming down from here and here. We've got one whole side of the map where we wouldn't have anybody coming in from, because it's mountains, right? It's not too bad. There's also here... Where we could potentially um, have this as an entrance. So this would be a huge kill box into like a big mountain base. But we'd get infestations from time to time. Do you think, um, do you think infestations are easier to deal with than like sappers and shit like that? Just adapt to the mountain. And go for hydroponics. Infestations do suck, but I think I think you can deal with them, right? So we'd have all of this fertile soil here to start with before the hydroponics and stuff start working. I mean, equally, we could just build into here, but then we'd have because it's exposed on two sides. This would be too hard to defend, right? So maybe it's easier to do it here. Just have some farming outside, and then when we get raided, whoop, everybody goes in. <coughs> Pardon me. If you build tunnels with doors to create chokes, it's quite easy to deal with a few bugs. Yeah, we can always get it later. Yeah, that's true, actually. I have to think like that far ahead, right? And then we got this, uh, we got a nice vent here too. Vents aren't a huge problem though, right? We can just pick them up when we need them. All right, let's start, let's start setting up in here then. close this off first. Um, and then let's get some orders in to chop a bunch of wood. Wood. Work. Manual priorities. Doctor, patient, doctoring, shitty lurkers got some doctoring skills, bed rest, haul plus, hauling urgently, high priority hauling, works like the regular kind, but only for things that are manually designated, use architect orders, haul urgently, okay, haul urgently, child care, basic, warden, we have no social, or very little social. So Ramsey 8 is going to be our warden. We can do handling. We can do great cooking. We've got some hunting skills and stuff here, too. Who is our, who is our shooter? It's Ramsey 8 who's got the, our best shooting, right? Ramsey 8. So, hunting, but no handling. Some handling, hunting. All right, so Ramsey 8. Let's give you the bolt action rifle. Uh, Shady Lurker, you can have the revolver. And NyQuil can have the wooden, uh, wooden Gladius. Ramsey will equip the Plasteel Knife as a sidearm. All right, construction, yes. Let's put you on this as well. Uh, mining, Ramsey 8, and then crafting, tailoring, crafting. No art for now. And then research. Research. 
Ramsey can do some cleaning as well. All right. Um, who's doing our cutting and planting? I think everybody should do cutting, right? For now. Don't need everybody to do growing, though. Okay. We're going to want a growing zone. over top of all of this fertile soil. Um, and we'll make this uh, rice just so that we can get lots of uh, food quickly to start with. Um, and then we just want to get another uh, wall. Actually, probably get a door here too, right? So we can get through if we need to. And then let's get another wall like down here with the door. And then we'll build a uh, structure for these people to live in for now, right? Look at these guys just like taking 10 years to cut down all these trees. Do not put the door near the rice field. What? Oh, you think just have the door on the other side? It might. Yeah, you might be right, actually. It's the door is the weak point, right? They'll go for it and they'll get in and burn down all my rice. And the rice will block the door as well. Of course, of course. We do not want that to happen. All right. Wooden wall. Do, 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 do. Hey, we've done it. Just got to start working on this now. People might sleep outside today. I'm not sure. Does the biome get winters? No, this one doesn't. No, we started in a uh, in one that doesn't. We got a bit of wildlife out here. Some boom rats. We don't have any boom elopes though, it doesn't look like. <coughs> I think one night sleeping under the stars is probably fine, right? It'll probably be okay. Or no. I think one night sleeping under the stars in the pouring rain. Hopefully they found a tree. Yeah, we're building Helm's Deep exactly. Yeah. That's, that's the one we're going for. Helm's Deep. All 
All right, let's get a couple of shelves set up just for now. So we can start getting some stuff moved in here. Let's get a stockpile. And in this, we'll do important clear all chunks, stone chunks. Okay, let's get this stuff out of here. <coughs> Furniture, let's get a nice torch lamp. Let's also make sure that we get a um, passive cooler in here too. And let's also get a table with some chairs. The butthole was just too toxic. Chase's big butthole, you mean? You mean Chase's big, big huge butthole? Okay, Ramsey 8 is having a nice time sleeping in a bed under shelter as well. And we're cooling it down a little bit in here too, keeping it nice and cool. We got some animals. We got uh, Shady Lurker 01, who we can start training. Doo 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 doo. Do we have any night owls? No. The table's not done yet. Does this go towards plants? Oh yeah, it does. So cutting all these trees is gonna give them some planting experience. Yeah, toxic fallout really, really screwed us um, on the last one. We gotta be more ready for them in the future. Shady's the hunter? No, we set uh, Ramsey to be the hunter. Maybe it makes sense for Shady to be the hunter, actually, because of the, uh, the animals stuff. So you're a night owl? Nice. Alright. There's a manhunter pack of raccoons. Two raccoons approaching. Um, if we just... Um, missing five times wood. Oh no. I know. Um, who's our doctor? It's NyQuil 89. Health, self tend.
Here they come. Uh oh. Hit them, maybe? With the gun? No. <clears throat> I mean, don't shoot him. He's down. Holy crap. All right, he's dead in five hours. Um, health, defaults, colonist. So Shady is going to have to tend to him. I think he's dead. Four hours? Three hours? It's going to be close. Okay, good. All right. Well, we can't build anything for a little while now. While this guy rests. Infection City, here we come. I know, I know. Low food, low medicine. We have lots of medicine. Toxoid wasters. Well. Again. Oh shit, the dog. He's <laughs> <laughs> got bitten and scratched, and then he died. Good job, doggy. Very nice. Right in the spine. He's coming down here to eat a nice meal out in the rain, pouring rain. These guys sleep a lot, huh? Oh no! The dog's tail's been destroyed. Shady Lurker's tail was destroyed. You're doing great, Dad! Hello, Dictator Sips. It has been too long. Remember me? Yes. Wanted to let you know I have reformed the Patriots and we are now thriving. I bet Watch you out, are. Traitor. We're coming to settle the score. <laughs> hey, Chase, thanks so much for the 10. I um, I appreciate it. And uh, Joanne Mihawk, thanks so much for the 420 as well. Thanks. Oh, my God. Need a bionic tail? Heck, yeah. All right, NyQuil 89 can slowly get better. Hello. You're gonna feed Terry. Yeah. 
<laughs> Where is he? He's in there. Yes. Yeah, good. Good progress, yeah. Yeah. You guys must be exhausted after all that walking. Yeah. You're gonna wave. You're gonna wave to Terry. Yeah. Good waving. Good waving. Oh, careful, careful, careful. <laughs> More. <laughs> He doesn't need more, he's gonna get sick if he has too much. Oh. Oh, she's gone. She's out. Man, he's loving it. You should see his face, he's smiling. Terry's smiling. Where are we going to put um, dead bodies so that they don't get uh, seen all the time by people passing by? I guess it doesn't matter. Like the, the, the rotten animal corpses and stuff, it doesn't really matter, right? Where we put them. But these other ones we want to get rid of and... I guess we just chuck them here for now, right? Just build like a little wall. Um, storage. Rotten, fresh, clear all. We just want to store corpses here, right? But we don't want um, colonist corpses on here. And we only want to put, um, oh yeah, we're going to have to put, um, we'll change it over when the time comes, right? I don't have any wood. Let's let them do all this hauling before we chop down more trees, though, because, are you dead? No, nah, you're not dead. You're recovering. You got bitten and scratched a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot. <clears> hey, <throat> okay, furniture. Let's get some more wooden shelves in here. You're back! One dandelion at a time. I don't think Terry minds. Nyquil's starving. Oh, it's alright. He's eating now. And he's eating at a table as well. Intense pain. Unsightly environment. Ate without a table. There's a mad rat in here. Bye-bye. See you later. How could you... Michael, do not go outside. Where is this rat? Where did the rat go? <coughs> Maybe the dog without a tail can uh, can deal with this rat. It's got to um. It's got to go unmad at some point, right? Whoa. <laughs> oh my god, man. The dog is eating meals. It goes unmad on death. It's just a couple little scratches, it's fine. 
she'll be she'll be good as good as new in no time. Uh, orders, chop some more wood. You're back again. You just bring it one at a time. Is that fun? Yes. <laughs> nice. <coughs> Terry is going insane, yeah. He loves it. Oh, she's hand feeding him. Careful, careful. Put your feet on there. There you go. Um, Ramsey 8 thinks that we should give our faction a name. What should our faction be called? <coughs> Malmo. Ramsey 8 also thinks you should give this settlement a name. <laughs> what should... Where's Elmo? Oh, you gotta be careful. Oh, oh, hang on. Oh. Terry, stay in there. No, 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 no. He's trying to come out. Um, what do you want to call this uh, this settlement chat? Do I find Terry just goes a bit nuts once the weather warms up? Yes, he does. Yeah, he knows. He wants to be out there. Uh, Chase's, Ch Chase's, um, gigantic prostate. Okay. Perfect. Great name, everybody. Really nice. No. <laughs> oh, you did let a fly in. Go, 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 quick. Okay, we've got to wake this guy up from hospital. There we go. Perfect. Okay. Now at least, right? I think just to just to combat like um you know, little like uh little like uh, animals and shit getting through, we just need to like uh do a slight a slight murder, right? Would be nice. Just a just a little slight murder. Security, spike traps. Structure, fence. That doesn't have to be anything crazy. Just has to be, you know. Just a little murder closet. Yeah, that's that's it. You're gonna let the flies in. <laughs> yes. He's still eating. Look. Put it through the bars. Yeah, I gave him a whole whack of food this morning, too. <laughs> oh, man. It is a corridor to no nowhere for now, yeah. But once uh, NyQuil 89 is uh, back up and kicking, we'll be fine. God, it's raining a lot, eh? Jeez. There's still, like, loads of meals down here. He can't possibly eat another bite. Oh, no. <laughs> The water bottle bloop was nice. You like that? We got the hauling mod, yeah. People are kind of hauling. Hey, is this guy better? He's better. He's feeling a little bit better. 
Okay, the dog is eating berries. It's okay. Once we get some, uh, once we get this guy up and we start getting some some gerbs done, should be fine, right? We should be good. Orders. Chop a little bit of wood out here too. We're gonna need some. Start getting to work on cutting some blocks would be nice as well. Do do do. If we could get some. Uh, if we can get some blocks done, then we can start building uh, some stronger stuff not out of wood, right? All it takes is one boomalope. There's one turtle inside the fence? That's fine, we'll hunt him after. Maybe the dog can eat him. store all of our wood here. Alright, NyQuil 89 is fully healed. What an incredible day. It says that he ate without a table, but actually just ate at a table. I watched him do it. His mood is rising. And it's especially rising now that he's doing the thing he loves. Constructing furniture. Are there any are there any boomalopes out there? No. Nope. Hello. For me. I don't want to eat that. I don't want to eat that. Are you going to give it to Terry? He likes that. He'll eat that. Yes. But not too much. One more? Last one? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yeah, drop it through the top. There. Say bye, Terry. Say bye. Wave. Yeah. Oh. Man, this guy spent all day building four chairs. See you later. Bye. Is it? Oh my god. I think uh I think the TV is on <laughs> in the house. I think the TV is on in there. Great some great shows on that thing. Man. Really good shows. Some of the best shows. Four chairs in one day does seem pretty reasonable, actually. You're right. You are right about this. Okay, clear all. Important. We want raw resources. We want wood in these. And we're going to link up all the other ones, too. Okay. Let's link these. Can link them before they're built can you actually i did not realize that uh clear all in here we want uh stone blocks for now let's add a bill to make slate blocks until we have probably not that many 150 is enough. I can't imagine that we would need 2,000 blocks, you know what I mean? Uh, that's just a, too many blocks. Alright, it looks like we're finally starting to plant some rice. A wild woman has wandered in. Mida Biartra. 
It's K96, actually. 12 plants, animals, crafting. Um, a recluse, staggeringly ugly. Misandrist with no shooting. Uh, no social, no intellectual. It's because she's a Neanderthal. But uh, strong melee. And actually, we could just train her up to do some more melee. And that might be pretty good, right? Her, she spent, she's 67 years old. She spent most of her adulthood as a plank cutter. Feed her to the dogs. Oh shit. Psychic Soothe Mail? We'll take it. Nice. There's a whole bunch of meals over here. Equally, there's meals here too. Hopefully we're training this stupid dog to go do some hauling for us. Would be nice. Would be really nice. Cargo pods. With a million meals on them. There is a bear over here though. If we get inspired taming, I think we go and try to tame that bear would be nice. NyQuil 89 is going over to eat a meal and lay in a field. K96 is stealing a meal. Has actually actively stolen a meal. We need some little, um, some little prison cells, right? We'll set these up quick so that if we need to take any prisoners, we can. Get to hydrate? No, I haven't been. I have been hydrating big time. That's for prisoners as well. All right, nice, 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 nice. Mm Let's get a door on here so that when people go out there, they don't have to look at this dead person. A little bit risky hauling from over here, but what can you do? And uh, it looks like we've picked up everything. NyQuil89 is wearing the uh, the armor, which is pretty good. Has he picked up his sword again? He has. Excellent. I think this turkey... Just stepped on one of our traps. Good shooting. Never give up. Hi. Yeah, just put it there. It's fine. Thank you. That's great. Yeah, you too. Thanks. Man, I gotta start locking my door. Too many visitors. <laughs> Fuck. It is kind of... Ooh, the ambushed Praetor. Leontius Lascaris, a praetor of the Exodus Empire, is calling from nearby. His guards were killed in an ambush. He escaped, but is now being followed by a man-hunting rat. Lascaris wants you to keep him safe at Chase's gigantic prostate for a few hours until his shuttle can come pick him up. 
He will bestow eight honor on whoever accepts this quest. This is enough honor to receive a royal title of yeoman and all the benefits that come with it, including the first level of psychic powers. Okay, I can't remember who had any social in here. It's Ramsey 8. We don't need to have social, but I guess it's good to have some social. Okay, Ramsey 8. A ship cracker. A ship cracker. Zone. Expand allowed area. Manage areas. Rename this one. We're going to call this uh, safety. Okay. And then inside safety, we want to be like so. Like so. Just for now. Here comes the man hunting rat. Quickly, everybody, get in. <laughs> Okay, good. <laughs> we, we did it. Chickens joined. Holy hell, that's a lot of chickens. That is a heck of a lot of chickens. Structure. Let's get some fence here and here. With a fence gate. We can keep these chickens for a bit. Get some free eggs. Okay, this guy is... He's out. Nice. Okay, Ramsey 8 has become a yeoman. One, one yeoman. All right, Ramsey 8. The expected quality of this one is not great. But it's got to be done, right? Oh, one of our roosters was torn to death by the bear buy one 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 bear before we could get the animal pen going actually we lost one dirt floor hut hey we're just getting set up okay takes time all right honorable bestowing ceremony and ramsey 8 uh, has now become a yeoman ramsey 8 is not capable of doing any uh any moves just yet can actually do pain block. All right, fair enough. Fair enough. What's this stuff? Limestone chunks? Do until we have 150 as well. All right, the psychic soothe is em is ending. Another wild man has wandered in, Labadoo. It's um, Miss Miss Abraden. This guy's got melee shooting. He's a slowpoke and he's incapable of shooting. So sorry, he's incapable of social. He can do some planting and stuff too. This 
There's a 30% 30, 30 chance to kidnap this guy. Where's that other one gone? K96. We got a 30% chance to get her. NyQuil. Okay, I think what we'll do is... We were going to train her up to be melee, but let's actually capture this guy instead. Okay, everybody get out here. Let's go. Mr. Braden, we're, we're going to try to abduct you. We're going to try to imprison your ass. Did not quite work out. Okay, good. Okay, we'll capture Missa Braden. The wild person. We could have tried to tame, but... It's ancient razor wire. Alright, it's just a bit... Nyquil's just a bit bruised up. He'll be fine. He'll survive. <coughs> He's gonna make it. This guy's gonna make it. He's self-tending in in our mud hut. Okay, this guy on the other hand is not gonna make it. Okay. This guy is going to make it. Some pretty bad tending, though. Alright, prisoner. Oh, I don't even have a, a chance to, uh, to recruit him. Is it because he's wild? It's because he's too wild? Oh, you have to tame him. What about finish off? I'm going to try to finish him off. I guess him being in prison, it's a little bit easier to tame him in there, right? Can we convert him first? We got a visitor here. From the nation of Gorarna. He's got a few items to trade. That's nice. Another wild man has wandered in, called Guog. Guog is a pig man who has excellent social skills. However, he's jealous, tough, and does creepy breathing and is incapable of violence. Um, misc. Okay, good. Let's see if we can get some of these chickens over here. Do do do. What do you got? A gun link? Synth red pants? They're mine. Steel club? You can have it. He's got it's got some herbal medicine. He's got a bunch of pemmican as well, sure. We didn't have any herbal medicine, you see. Are they rounding up the chickens? No. There's still a few of them out here, but there are, like, there's a fox and a bear out here as well. I don't know who our big guy... Uh, oh, yeah, here's one of them. Nice.
Ramsey's a recluse and, and she gets a buff for being in a small group. Hey, look at this. <laughs> oh, it's cute. Look at all these little chickens. Some, um, we need some food production. Also, we need to uh, plant some more food as well, right? I guess everybody's just doing hauling and stuff for now. Oh, look at this with the double. Well, we can slaughter some uh, chickens if we need to. They'll lay eggs as well, which we can we can eat. Build some nest boxes. No slaughter. You don't want to be slaughtered. start mining some stuff here. Do you feel like having an egg sandwich now? Oh my god. It's gonna take us a long time to get into the mountain at this rage <laughs> at this rate. It's gonna it's gonna be really slow going. <laughs> I think we practice a bit out here first before we start making headway. Why are the turkeys in the death box instead of eating them um oh i didn't set up the uh the the animal one so this storage here is going to be just for human corpses and then we're just going to get another one out here for rotten animals Rotten animal corpses. And then fresh animal corpses we'll put into our freezer when we get the freezer. We got any boomalopes on the map? There's a warg and a bear, though. I don't know. Have we started working on conversion? I suppose we have. All right. Um, oh, there's a bunch of steel here, too. Nice. So let's get rid of some of this zone. Let's remove this roof area where we can. So that we don't have any big cave-ins. We're having a heat wave. I think we just fed that guy raw eggs. I think we're going to be eating raw eggs at this rate, too. It's not looking too good. Let's get out here and harvest some berries. We should have some rice coming up soon. It looks like they planted the rest of it, too, which is kind of nice. We might just need to eat raw berries for a bit. It was good enough for rock. Yeah, you're right, you know. 
you're right, you're right. It was good enough for Rocky. If it's good enough for Rocky, it's good enough for me. If it's good enough for him, then it's good enough for me. I think if we get the dog trained up, it'd be pretty good. Ramsey and NyQuil89 both have heat stroke. It's 42 degrees out, out here. It's 30 degrees in here. We're gonna need to get another passive cooler, I think, to really cool it down in there. Oh, an eclipse. It won't go below 15 degrees with a passive cooler. I'm a passive cooler, excuse me. No. Uh, zone. Remove roof area. All right, it's 17 degrees in here. It's 30 degrees outside. We got some... We... Oh. Mr. Braden got food poisoning from eating raw rice. That's not good. That's not good. Um, we need to set up like a little um, cooler area, right? And then we can, once we have some power, we can get those meal fridges going as well. Could be good. Don't let them die of dysentery. Okay, I'll try not to. It's 43 degrees out there. We're in the middle of a huge heat wave. We're getting raided by one man with a club. All right, let's make sure that we stay in safety for now. Production, fueled stove. I think if we can, let's try to make a couple of meals, right? We'll just make um, simple meals until we have six. Two per day. All right, nice. The dog is eating rice. Trained attack, 90% chance. Heat wave is finally over. This man died? Uh. <laughs> <laughs> He's dead. Phil just hops the fence. Enemies, um, enemies don't seem to hop the fence. They just run right through the traps. <laughs> the raccoon is eating my eggs. I'll get him, don't worry. 
Next thing he'll be attacking and eating my my chickens as well. <laughs> it's uh this raccoon's called Gummy Gopher. He's dead. You ripped him a new one. Alright, well, we're out of food again. We're gonna be out of food fairly often, I think. Until we get sort of up and running. Some ancient mech. Do we want this guy? Animals and social? Coma child nurse with nine medical? Okay, let's try to tame Phil Thund Thundiuk. Yeah, he is eating all of our food, you're right. Vagabonds hope for alms. Giso and Vasper the Duck. They want 30 silver. Should I give them 30 silver? Is there any other food that I could harvest out here? I guess I really need to just start hunting. <laughs> hunting animals, right? Hauling them back to some sort of freezer that we store meats. Uh, zone? Build a roof area? Power? Let's get a wood fire generator for now. Why can't I click on this person? Why can't I um, c click on this person to give them silver? Oh, we don't have silver? No, we do, though. We have enough. Capture Giso. Oh, there, now I could do it. All right. There you go. 30 silver. Maybe they'll leave us a, a charge rifle behind or something, you know? It could happen. You never know. All right. Um, temperature? A single refrigerator? Rottable things stored in this will not spoil. Or a wall single. So this can go right in the wall. Whereas this one just sits like here. That's pretty cool. Alright, nice. So in here... We want to say preferred, clear all, and now we don't want meals. Allow all, sorry, and then we, but we don't want meals. In here, it's important, and we just want 
meals. It already comes set, preset. It's pretty good. Production. Mm, I don't want to make that out of steel. I used up all my wood. All right, let's get some more. Yes, I do just need some meals now. You're right. I'm on it. Pretty good. The allow tool. I like that. <laughs> you think the tortoise would make a fine meal? Well, all these eggs I keep eating raw. tiny bit of starvation happening owing to there being not a lot of food we're gonna have to get this butcher table up and running just for now right except bill butcher creature do forever I think maybe the dog ate the uh, the raccoon. Okay, let's get some of this stuff. We need food. God, there's so many people mooching around here, too. It makes it more difficult. The Aurora has ended? All right, let's get them. Oh, the schedule. Whoops. We wanted to... get people hunting. Alright, let's try killing some stuff close by so we can butcher it up and make some quick meals. We might have to butcher um, a chicken or two or use their forbidden eggs. Miss mm. Braden has gone berserk. Hold the door! It'll pass off soon, don't worry. Look at all this free construction as well. Look, every time, look at this construction. Mm -hmm. 
It's like a like a free construction factory. All right. Meals. Oh, he's out. Oh shit. No. <laughs> He went berserk. He's slicing up everybody. All right. My door. The dog. The poor dog. Honorio's cache of fortune? All right, this guy's going to make it, no problem. A flat screen television. Wow. There's an unknown threat there, though. Who knows? All right, we gotta go do some more hunting. A low female psychic drone. I believe so hard. Oh my God, what a shot. That's so good. There's a mega sloth in our pen. Shady Lurker is about to have a break. Ravenously hungry. Shady Lurker is on an insulting spree. Mr. Braden's got a disease. Shady Lurker is just standing there insulting. They left a dead turkey in Mr. Braden's room with the disease as well. God, this what a miserable colony, eh? Holy shit. This is a rough one. I think we just fed the turkey. Now we're feeding the dead turkey to Mr. Braden. Nyquil89, who is injured. Shady Lurker is eating raw meat. Feeding raw meat to the dog. Oh, he's trained him in rescue, though. This is a fucking disaster. Didn't we get a mod that made them do smarter things? Because everything I've just witnessed them do is dumb as hell. Why did we download a, a, a Be Smarter mod when they're still just fucking stupid as hell? No, you really can't fix stupid. I think it, we've proven it. It can't be fixed. We're still trying to convert. I don't know if we try to convert. I think we just need to tame this person probably not so much this one I don't even know who is meant to be taming this person NyQuil with 8 skills Seventeen percent chance. We killed a tortoise. What else is close by that we can hunt? Probably not the rhinos.
Let's hunt a, a buck. Let's hunt a buck and hopefully the warg doesn't chase us. We got a whole bunch of rice coming out now. Okay, we actually have some meals now. We're out of power though. Look at how many meals she's just cooked up. That's so many meals. There's plenty more where that came from. Oh my god. Doing one meal at a time. Incredible. Cooking level 12. Jeez. It's pretty good. Alright, at least the psychic drone has ended. What a beast, I know. I insane. Okay, we might 14% chance. Failed. Massive failure. Hugest failure. Alright, well, we still haven't refueled the generator. Well, Mr. Braden's dead. The infection caught up with them. Mr. Braden was like one of the ones that we wanted to try to get. One of the better ones. There was, there was a, a solid attempt was made. Just a solar flare now. Um, remove roof area. Fourteen percent chance. I guess it's good. Uh, it's good practice, though. Why are we out of power again? We got 2.9 days worth of fuel here, but this is saying it's not powered. It's too far away. It is not. It's connected. Oh, it's the solar flare, of course. Thank you, chat. Thank you. Now we got some food. It took a little while, but we're there. We got some. Need to make a little freezer. I think this rich soil is helping us a lot. The Whittical family is raiding me. It's one Wookiee. Okay, let's keep let's try to stay safe. The Wookiee might get through actually. Well, we just wait. I don't know if five traps is enough to take one Wookiee down. It might be, but equally, it might not be enough. 
could be rough. Let the Wookiee win? No. It's Erica. Oh my god. Holy shit. Look at the shooting and misogynist, body purist, abrasive, psychically dull, incapable of dumb labor and caring. It's just like me. Yeah. Hey, some free smoke leaf joints in there, though. It's pretty good. Savor. <sighs> Two hours. I don't know. Do we want this person? Seems like a... Seems like a nightmare. I guess the animals is pretty good though, right? The social's good? Social, animals, shooting? I guess so. It's a mouth to feed without any hauling or cleaning though. World's number one hunter. I don't even know if she survives this. Dead. Just could not. Close. We didn't have any herbal medicine, sadly. Well, don't worry, there'll be other there'll be other ones like that that will no doubt take us down. Structure, slate wall. We'll start with like a, a a smaller freezer, I think. Human revenge. Uh oh. Lead. And the dog's helping now, too. Well, that's NyQuil out for another week now because of injuries. Well, at least that's uh, one less mouth to feed, right? We tried. I know, what a tank, eh? Look at this. Just every damn part of the body was shot or scratched. Incredible. He tend himself? Oh, yeah, he did. Okay, nice. Shady Lurker was just bruised in the neck a little bit. It's fine. Well, we are getting a healthy dosage of Randy Random. Randy Random Random Randy is randoming all over us. 
Was it a Neanderthal? No, it was a pig. I'm sure it was a pig. Yeah, it was a pig skin. Reduce pain. And pig voice. All right, Shady Lurker has recovered. Shady Lurker just smoked weed. Do you have good genes? No, you're all baseliners, so you just have the uh, the two default genes. None of you guys are any different um, alien race things or whatever. Ship to the stars. Quest received. Make a meditation spot. Man, I, I haven't even used any of the, uh, the energy. I haven't used a single bit of energy yet. I think the dog is nearly fully trained now, which is kind of nice. Oh, pardon me. Oh, pardon me. Oh, man. I'm yawning. No, I haven't done anything with the dryad tree things yet. I'll have to look into it at some point. I'm struggling enough just to do really basic things in this game. I don't want to start looking into... Oh, okay, good. Our builder is back. Excellent. Power, conduit. So this provides us with a thousand watts. Nice chicken collection, thank you very much. Um, architect. Let's get a temperature. Let's get an overwall cooler in here. How am I going to kill Dowie this time? Don't worry, I'll find a way. Life always, life finds. Dowie, Dowie's, Dowie's death always finds a way. Chop some wood. There's a little bit of wood to be chopped inside the base. We can do it. So a wall light uses 20 watts per. That's not too bad. Do, do. All right, 
structure slate wall. So we want to have it's like this, and then that like that. And then we want to have a wooden door here and a wooden door here. Nice. Let's turn this bad boy down. Shady Lurker 1 is having a food binge. Sure. <coughs> we got food. We're going to have food very shortly, a more, a more stable food. Oh, this isn't roofed zone. Ignore roof area. Okay, now it should get nice and cold in here. Perfect. And then we can have a production electric stove. And then we can also have a temperature wall single refrigerator. This is going to be so good, by the way. It's a refrigerator. It replaces the wall. Excellent. Furniture. We need a wall light in here. And in here. And let's get one here too. And then let's also get a chair out of. We don't have light leather, plain leather, bird skin, or lizard skin. So it's gonna have to be a wooden dining chair. So we wanna cook. Um, for now, we just wanna do. Simple meals, right? Until we have, say, 20. Take to best stockpile. Can we fit them in here? You wish that you were... Can they access the fridge from both sides? I believe they can, yeah. I'm not sure, but I'm hoping that, yes, they can. S simple meal four times. I think I want um, simple meal four times as well. Until we have 20. It's the advent of Chateau. We'll put a ritual spot, but I'm not really equipped to do this ritual just yet. Can't wait to build some more in the morning. I know, it's so exciting, isn't it?
cargo pods with eggs. Bill Shator. Let's get some floors in here. We can make just some concrete. It's fine. I started making the bed spirals. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, I don't know if I want to do a barracks, but you know. Okay, so we want to storage, important, clear all foods, raw food, including chocolate and baby food. I don't think you can uh, access the other link settings. Oh, maybe you can. The planned ones or the unbuilt ones? I'm not sure. Oh yeah, it's worked. That's so good. All right, in here, this is gonna be important for meals, carnivore meals, simple meals. Let's get rid of this. Oh my god! Like a little million chicks just came out of those eggs! Good god. That's a lot of chickens. <laughs> Holy crap, how am I gonna sterilize all those chickens? too many. Hey, look at this. Oh, this one can go now, actually. We don't need two of these. Right, so what we need to do is, there's, there's a way to, um, so storage, simple meal, Is a simple meal just a simple meal, regardless of the the color of the dot on it? It's just simple. Simply simple. See, but this one's got green. It's vegetarian. This one ha is chicken eggs. Okay, but the question is, can they stack all the same colors together as a simple meal? Because she's just left that on the ground now. But she should have taken it to, in, to put it into storage. See, we've got all these ones as well, but they're not being taken either. See, cannot haul simple meal, no empty accessible spot. So because this fridge has a simple meal in it that isn't vegetarian. It's not working. But there's nowhere for me to to say put only vegetarian simple meals into one or whatever, you know? So we'd have to say that this is just going to be vegetarian. These simple meals. Oh, 
Oh, hello. So this wall f fridge is using 70 watts of power. It's minus eight in there. Um, Ramsey, do you want to trade with these guys and see if they've got anything? Oh, look, they want to buy all these chicks. That's way too many chicks. It's 136 bucks worth of stuff, though. You can sell the dog as well. We don't need that many chicks. There's a cooking skill trainer here. It's a thousand bucks, though. Oh, there's a field hand for 577. Oh, man. Okay, I'm going to take it. This is going to be wild. I'm taking it. Okay. We've got a bit of medicine. We can do an operation. But wait. We'd want to do an operation on um, NyQuil89. Who is... Actually, what are the skills? 9, 3, and 2? Let's put it on Ramsey. Okay, Ramsey. You're getting a field hand. This is going to be insane. Oh, shit. Oh, no, it's all right. I just sold all these. Yeah. Here we go. We're going to give it to somebody who doesn't even have a passion... Oh, look at this. The meals that are being created right now. I don't know why she's making this many meals when we only want to have... Oh, it's 20 that we want, right? She's not meant to be dropping them on the ground, though. Take the best stockpile. Take the best stockpile. Can you only fit 10 in here? Work to make... Work to make 5? Hit points 50 out of 50. I guess you can only fit 10. Alright, sure. Hey, what's up, Ravs? How you doing? Alright. Get all this. Oh. Okay, Ramsey. Ramsey has a field hand now. Ramsey's gonna have a field hand in one on one hand and a drill hand in the other. And Ramsey's gonna be unstoppable. <laughs> nice. All right, we got a good supply of food. Got a really nice supply of food. We got a, a decent little kitchen set up here. K96. Plants, animals, crafting. Recluse, misandrous, and staggeringly ugly. And is now in here. Stealing all my shit. I hate that. <clears throat> that really gets my goat. <laughs> Zone. Build a roof area. We need a good dining room, though, right? So maybe we shouldn't do that. Zone. 
ignore roof area. The hunter has a field arm? Yes. Wait, is Ramsey our hunter? Or is it Shady Lurker? I can't remember. It doesn't matter. It's just fun to have a field arm, right? It just goes so fast. Now uh, this is a new save, perhaps we died again. Level 10 plants for Nyquil 89, it's pretty nice. Guess we gotta start building some rooms for people. All right, the dog is fully trained to haul now. You don't need to make any of these. We, we already have 10 in, in storage. What the hell? Just can't stop cooking, I know. She loves cooking this one. All right, now we got a whole bunch of meals on ice. Very good. No more cooking required. All right, production. Let's get a hand tailor bench. Is there any hunting that can be done down here? A tiny bit. We got bulk goods trader turning up. So that's annoying. We gotta move this butcher table, but I didn't I didn't allow for enough room to build the butcher table and to store corpses. We'd have to build this like up and around here, which would be really, really pretty dumb. Oh, the eggs in here, Jesus. Yeah, we got a bit of food, Dowie. Uh, bulk goods. What do you got? Um, we got a lot of rice. We got a lot of eggs. 117 bucks worth of eggs. Take them. Take them, we don't need them. We'll keep all this leather and stuff because we want to start making some clothes. In the meantime... We could get grab some herbal medicine maybe. Okay, bills add a bill. We need pants. Make pants. Let's make um some t shirts. Let's make some cowboy hats. Let's make some dusters. Where are the dusters at? Dusters. Do until we have... One. Details. Five to twenty. Take the best stockpile.
normal. Fifty one to hundred, normal to legendary. Five. And same with this, right? All right, once we start making some clothes, oh. It's Ultra Monka. A nine-year-old preteen refugee. Already a nudist. Okay. Sure. Paralytic Abasia. Okay, we don't actually need to... Uh, that's fine, look. Ramsey can come and rescue Ultra Monka. A four-year-old child named Yu is calling from nearby. He says a pack of two men hunting Yorkshire Terriers are hunting him. He begs for safety and offers to join you at Chase's gigantic prostate. Um, yeah, sure, okay. Hopefully we can get Ramsey out here in time. Yu is coming in to join as well. The Manhunter pack chasing Yu is is in. Ramsey is kind of caught out down here. I don't know if they go for... Oh no, it looks like they're going for the colony first. Okay, it's fine. <laughs> All right, you. Bed rest. Hall plus. Child care. Basic. Ultra Munka. Don't do any of this crap. We just want you guys hauling and cleaning. Okay, the Yorkshire Terriers are dead. We're gonna need a school, yeah. Don't have anybody doing childcare. We're gonna have to get Ramsey 8 to do it. He's the only one. Maybe he can get some skills along the way. Okay, it's an investment. We're investing in children. You know? Alright. We also want to assign you and Ultramunka to safety. We don't want them going out, right? <laughs> Are they the future? Oh, yeah. You got it. All right, good job, you. Ultra Monka is going to be in a hospital bed for quite some time. We're going to need to get a new um, bed thing going. We're almost out of wood. Just gotta go out and do some chopping. <laughs> oh yeah, we need a new name for um, you as well, right? Blogus1225. <laughs> OK, 
Okay, Blogus1225, you can have that bed. Made a nice bedside table for you there as well. Look at all this food we've got. K96 just looking on, hoping and praying that one day get to join this awesome colony. It's not looking very likely though, I don't mind saying. Um, right, let's get a school desk in here with uh, some blackboards. A couple stools. Where are you going? Where are you going? Oh my god. Oh, getting a, a dead deer. Sure. <laughs> oh my god. You can't wait for a flash storm to land right on top of my crack house? Excuse me? That's not nice. That's not a nice thing to say to somebody about their crack house. How could you? You're gonna gonna um, Marie Kondo the heck out of this house. I'm I'm building this here, but uh, honestly, we'll we'll move it into the mountain once we move into the mountain. It's just just for now, right? Just for now. Just want to have this a little bit of a, a, a setup just for now. Am I getting debuff for mining? No, my people are not mole people at all. They're just normal people. The deserter. Sisa Asma, an infantry medic, is calling from nearby. He has deserted the army of the Exodus Empire and is being hunted by a loyalty squad. He wishes to join you at Chase's gigantic prostate. We'd have to fight one trooper. Um, no way. No way will I do that one. That sounds crazy to me. Said, it said that mining is despised in the memes or something. Mining is despised? No, no, it's, um... It's not... It's... It's impossible to set it to mining is despised. See, look, there's no, like, debuff for mining. We gotta build uh, walls there. Don't forget to convert the children. No, no, I won't. We'll do it. Construction level 12? This guy is insane. He's so fast. Another bulk goods trader? Another one. And another one. And another one. Another one. What time is it?
I might have to do the, um, the school run and stuff today. I think I might have to do it. I could uninstall shelves? True, yeah, I could. What the heck? Oh. We're out of wood. That's annoying. I need to tame a, uh, a boomalope. I think what is it's like three three boomalopes can can um power four chem fuel generators reliably as long as they don't get sick or die. <coughs> Remember the time I planted a tree farm in the middle of a forest? No. I've never done that before. I never once did that. I don't know what you mean. We can uninstall these three. Get rid of this as well. We're out of wood again. And then let's just get some more concrete flooring in here. Look at how fast Shady Lurker is getting at uh, planting. Very nice. Very nice. That's good. Oh, that's good. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, boy, is that good. All right. We want to get a um, production. Ah, actually, let's just move this bad boy in here. Um, and then we want to get a zone, stockpile zone in here. Priority, important, clear all. We want fresh only animal corpses. So that we can start getting some more, um, getting some more shit, getting some more leather and stuff, right? There's a lot of bucks out here. Hmm, normal fox fur pants. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Furniture, another wall light. You're getting sliced and diced? Oh, the, yeah, I know what you mean. Sorry about that. I think we can just murder K96. K96. K96 is sleeping in in our rice field. Am I addicted to RimWorld? Yeah, I am a little bit. Yeah, I've been, I've really been enjoying it. It's been nice to play it again. The dog just came in to eat some raw meat. Oh no, I hate that.
I hate the come coming in all the way to access it from this side. You're doing great, Dad. Does that have to happen? Yeah, the, that pathing is really weird. You're right. Can I have a food place for dogs? I suppose. Oh, look, we're getting some cowboy hats now. It's good. Nice. Free cowboy hats for everybody. Enjoy your new cowboy hat. Maybe this little kid can have a cowboy hat. Do I have Greg's trackies? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. No, I don't. Okay, cook a simple meal times four. You can start using meat and animal products now. That's fine. We've got two fridges. Meat. Not human meat, though, or insect meat. And animal products. Sure. Human meat and insect meat. Okay, perfect. Not that I'm ever, ever planning on having human or insect meat in my fridge, but, you know, like, uh, geez. No, I don't like insect meat. No, I don't. Architect, floors. Um, I guess we could do, do some limestone floor in here or something. Maybe. We need to start doing some research at some point. Look at everybody sound sound asleep. We need to start getting some rooms made for people as well, right? Hmm. <laughs> uh oh. Run, Ramsey, run. He's so far away from home. This could be it, actually, for Ramsey. Does have a knife, though. Stabbed it in the lung. Incredible. Alright, Ramsey Ramsey 8 is dead in 14 hours. Really struggling here. Been scratched up in all sorts. Pain block? Okay, Ramsey can move a little bit faster now because of the pain block. Uh, let's make this for medical as well.
Nice. I all patched up. All patched up and ready to go. Perfect. Look at all the food we have in here. It's insane. The the rice on the uh, fertile soil is really nice. A fox ate the head off a seven-year-old from yesterday. I've had a warg devour an entire child in like one. Like there's no trace left of the child in this. <laughs> I think like our first colony that happened. There, one hailed us on the comms and was like, "Save me! I'll join your colony." And the the moment they spawned into the map, a warg ate them, just devoured them. <laughs> Ultra Munka and Shady Lurker both have malaria. Um, hello? You, are you guys just, you done your dinner yet? Oh, this guy is incapable. I don't even know if this guy can do it. Firefight? Ramsey? You're gonna have to come out and help here, Ramsey. Jesus Christ. Lose the whole base. Oh no, not the wood. Don't let it happen. That was close. Holy Lord. How long have we been working on this colony? I don't know. A few hours? So Ultra Munka has been patched up. The malaria. And was Shady Lurker as well? Has not been treated. Alright. Should be fine. But it just means that nobody's going to be doing any work for this foreseeable future. Everybody is uh, everybody is down, bed resting. Who's going to cook up all these fine meals? Good job, NyQuil89. We got a Jade Meteorite that's landed. Pretty good. Shady Lurker needs to cut us some more stones. What is this? Oh, this is granite. That's why. We, don't, we need some more slate. Alright, let's get this stuff hauled in here if, if we can. A little bit after the fox incident, raiders hot dropped into a bedroom and lit my other child on fire. Your colonists did so many drugs after that. 
Yeah, I mean, it does just sound like very typical RimWorld stuff. It's a game. It's a game where stuff like that happens. I don't know. I still don't think we want this Neanderthal. Oh, what the melee is pretty... The thing is... If we fail on the attempt to uh, to tame... And she gets mad, a Neanderthal will fuck us up big time. How's the malaria going? All right, the immunity is doing pretty good. Could capture the the, the Neanderthal? I guess so, yeah. Oh, we haven't even hauled the rest of this wood. Don't need to chop any more just yet then. Although, if we can chop some in here... Yeah, there's a couple of trees. A couple of trees that we can fell within the safety of the base. Can you tame some beavers to chop the wood? I think they would eat the wood though as well. I don't think I don't think they're satisfied. Oh no. Ultra Monka got food poisoning from Yorkshire Terrier meat. Uh oh. Low psychic drone females. Most of our females are not doing anything right now because of malaria. Ooh, pardon me. Where's this guy going? He's going all the way down here to meditate? That seems crazy to me. Let's get a meditation spot here instead. We can meditate in front of this flame, this open flame inside. You know what? We got some lights now. We can get rid of this, right? Power. Furniture. Larry is probably a good enough excuse not to do anything. Yeah, I've never had malaria, but I've heard it's... I heard it's real nasty. The most nasty. The sickest of, of all nasties. Just the biggest old nasty. <laughs> Shady Lurker, what the hell is wrong with you? Oh, hungry. Like, what are you doing, man? How about you probably... To you oh, fuck me. Okay, you gotta get out here and cook. I know you're not well, but Jesus. We need food. No wonder you're so hungry. You haven't been out to cook a single meal yet. You're like our main cook. There. Shit, a manhunter pack has turned up. Well, what do you know? It's beavers. 
It's Duckers and uh, Enlightened Titan. Okay, everybody. Don't take any chances. Get back in. Let K96 deal with them. It's our early warning system. No. She's one with the animals. Alright, everybody. Back out. Yeah, it's, it was just a little tiny man hunter pack. Nothing to worry about. Yeah, we did. We escaped them. Big time. Look at this. What's happening with the social here? It's going up. So teaching a child is a really good way of uh, leveling social if you want to, right? Doing the child care? Huh. Ha! Huh. Good. <laughs> She's back up. Is she immune now? Oh yeah, she's developed immunity. Nice. What about you? Yep. Also. Got a peg leg. This kid's got a peg leg already? Insane. Alright. Well, we can hopefully get on top of some of these jobs now. Be nice. Ramsey 8 is still hunting. has given up on hunting. How is the uh, the shooting going? Oh, yeah. A burning passion for shooting? So Ramsey 8's at 10 shooting. It should, should land some more shots now. Do, 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 do. I think we probably should draft hunt. It's probably safer, right? Uh-oh. An insane horse? <laughs> Tommy, that was close. <laughs> that was... That got, that got shady. Got really shady quickly. Yeah, this is the second time Blogus is pathed all the way into the kitchen to get food. He can get it from here. He's going to do it again. Oh, no, he hasn't done it again. See, everybody else just grabs it from here, no problem. Arrest me, I want to be in Chase's prostate. <laughs> There's no room in Chase's prostate at the moment. There's no room at the inn. We're full up in here. You miss this huge butthole? Oh man, it was a big base, wasn't it? We ought to make kind of sure that we're ready for um, toxic fallout and stuff this time, right? We gotta prepare. And if we're not prepared, we leave immediately with all the food. We just abandon. I know it can happen at any time. That's, that's what I'm saying. We just gotta be quick to react next time. You gotta get hydroponics going early. Fuck. So much power for it though, it's crazy, isn't it? Um, there's still no boomalope on the map. 
There's lots of little stuff. There's a injured warg out there. Oh, look at the dogs hauling. Just a little tiny haul before bed. You can get through volcanic or toxic if you have good trade set up. No, I suppose, yeah. Okay, this is for Anthro Relic is our religion relic thing. I've never gone for one yet. Look at the quest that I just never do it. Oh, for me. You ever just uh, take a quest and not bother finishing it? Oh, plain leather duster. Nice. Force weather for Lee. Psychic Sooth Pulsar. 13 Glitter World Medicine. This is 17 days of rainy thunderstorm. Oh. 17 days of rainy thunderstorm. I know it's not that bad. The food will still grow and stuff, but it's annoying. And people will be um, people will be miserable because it'll be soaking wet all the time, right? I don't know. For just for some glitter world medicine, like we, when we need some, we'll just get some, right? We don't need some right now. If that was if, if that was for something different, like a charge rifle or some, or you know, like even an assault rifle or would have been good but just for that no good oh ultra monk is having a growth moment in bed choose a trait for ultra monk at the game super immune i guess that's all we can give ultra monk -a. no um no no schooling could take place It's either that or greedy or misogynist. I think we just go for the super immune. So Ultra Monka is now 10 years old. Unbelievable. Incredible. Ultra Monka also is going to be in bed for 29 more days. The ten-year-old nudist. Yeah. How's this? How's this duster stuff going? Good, I hope. All right. Now we want to assign outfits to people. So, worker outfits. We're gonna say fifty-two to one hundred percent. Normal to legendary. Headgear. Cowboy hat. Armor, none. Utility. Noble apparel. Duster. Jacket. Pants. Parker rope sash. Yeah, okay, this is fine. T shirt. Okay, so that's worker. Oh wait, it's a anything. Soldier, soldier. Who's um? Who's not gonna be fighting? So Nyquil has three melee. Okay, Ramsey's got ten shooting. Shady Lurker has five melee. And six shooting. All right, so let's say Ramsey is going to be a soldier, Shady Lurker is going to be a soldier, and Nike will be a worker. We're not sure about the kids for now. Manage outfits, soldier. 
again, 52 to 100. Normal legendary, but this time armor, they can have it, right? Plant daylilies on the floor in the barracks to boost beauty. I don't want to have a whole bunch of flowers growing inside. It's gross. Okay, listen. Um, i got to go take a quick break. i probably got to go pick up my kids as well. But I'll have some lunch and do all that. And I'll be right back and we'll carry on, yeah? I can't believe we lost the other colony. I can't believe that we had to uproot like that because of the toxic fallout. And then everybody starved to death. <laughs> Uh, we've restarted and then we're, we're, we're just starting to sort of uh, get there with it as well. I'll be back in a minute, okay? See you in a minute? Okay. I made it. I've returned. Mm. Sorry it took me so long, but I'm back. We have a nice little safe base here. We had to restart. We lost the previous colony because of a toxic... Um, toxic fallout cloud or whatever so this time we're going to um try to make sure that we don't get um caught out by that again i got some tea yes i have tea there is tea and also k96 k96 ought to just join by now you're just living living in my, in in the grounds of my um, my paradise for free. You know, I'm in the money. I'm in the money. We haven't done a single bit of research yet either. To be fair, we don't really have anybody who can research very well. We haven't really had any inspirations yet either. Oh, another thing we want to do. Quest available, Royal Ascent. Yeah, sure. Another thing we want to do is for soldiers, we want to edit so that they can wear, for now, utility. Not utility, misc. <coughs> Please don't be afraid to wear a duster. Right now, soldier. And worker? Okay, good. Yeah. So I think having a nice duster on could be good. <clears throat> it could it could be good for uh, protecting your skin. It's like those uh, those chaps they wear on the uh, on the motorcycles, you know. They wear those leather chaps on the motorcycles. Oh my fucking god, man. Look at all of the chicks. <laughs> Holy shit. Just a million chickens. Just a million little chicks. Nice. Look how quickly it grows. It just grows so fast. We got so much food. We got we got more than enough food for the amount of people we have now, right? Really good. Really nice food. We got eggs for days. Uh, do we? We got like 20 eggs in here. It's not too bad. We got lots of uh, leather and stuff now. Got lots of steel. Looks like we're finally chopping up some uh, some slate so we can get the this wall um, finished. Look to get this one up here done too. There's a massive fire inside our our shack right now. Yeah. 
<laughs> just just watching watching the fire spread. You'd like a family bucket of chicken? Holy crap, that is a lot a lot of chickens. I'm I'm fairly sure that we don't have anyone with any decent intellect. So there's not much point in starting research just yet. We'll see if we can uh, if we can get somebody. Unless they have a passion for it, yeah. We have somebody, we can find somebody who has a burning passion to learn, to do knowledgeable things, right? This one is kept. Let's unlink these settings. And link these settings. You have a burning passion to learn? Nice. Um, can you give me two seconds? I just got to go speak to a guy quick before he goes. I'll be right back.
mates. Sorry, I'm back. All right, wall work, wall work, more wall work. And then we gotta get some people who can mine if we wanna start uh, breaking into this. And then also we need to probably think about some, there's probably gonna be some planning considerations as well, right? Because we need to be able to handle infestations. Do the, do the size of the infestation scale to like the size of my colony as well? Is it like, is it based on wealth and stuff or what? No. What happened? Oh, they had a social fight. What the heck? Oh, it is wealth-based, okay. So, if we have a high amount of wealth, then the infestations could be overwhelming. <coughs> as long as it's, uh, is it based on... Is it, um... In, o in order to stop infestations in certain areas, is it, like, based on light or is it just temperature? both right so even if it's really well lit they'll spawn if it's not like minus 20 in there give me a bed um what the hell dr new york dr new Dr. New male chick, <laughs> healthy. You don't need a bed. Hey, what do you need a bed for? You can make bait rooms that are big, empty, dark spaces. All right, okay. And they'll they'll prefer spawning in, in those? They usually spawn in the deepest parts, so they're easy to crown and burn to death. All right, so what? So you you mean like they're not gonna just spawn into like my uh, my dining room and stuff, or they might, they might spawn into the dining room, or they might all spawn into like somebody's bedroom. Who knows? We just need to have lots of airlocks. Airlock hallways. You're not a fighter anymore? No, you're not, Nike. Cool. Um, no, you're not. For now, at least, you're not. You've got a melee weapon, but... just It's just really to defend yourself if something tries to... But no. We need, we need some people who have a passion for fighting, you know? So that they can get better at fighting. You have passions in other areas that we're going to focus on. You know what I mean? Emergency eggs and a heater so you can mass hatch defense chickens. <laughs> they could that that could be a good uh, baiting strategy as well though, right? Getting like tons of chickens. What about a passion for fashion? Now you're talking. I, I love having a passion for fashion. Why have so many chickens? Well, I don't know. They just, tons of them just hatched. Randomly. So, some, some random hatchings occurred. Do, 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 do. This, this looks like a bit of a ball sack here. Or maybe just a pair of jugs. Look at this. Looks like a little bit of a, you know what I mean? You were just thinking that. Yeah, me too. Great minds think alike. 
turns out. When you put two, two, two great minds together, and they think alike. Nice. Oh. Looks like there's a dead donkey over here. Very good. All right. Well, pro Operation Wall is uh, is done. We now have sturdy walls. It's raining again. Maybe now that K96 is uh, is sleeping, it's a good time to... You know what? It's probably a decent time to try to tame her. If we... If we... She's incapable of none. To be fair, so she can do hauling and stuff, and looks like, but she's a recluse. The fewer people in K96's faction, the happier she is. Being alone is best of all. We already have a recluse, so it's just a, the bigger we get, it's just a guarantee mood debuff, right? Which is not great. It's quite small. Should we just get her then? Let's try to tame her. Um, Ramsey 8's got the uh, field hand. He's botching harvests left, right, and center. It's okay. All of this XP though plants it all adds up right and it adds up faster when you got a field hand and converge before you try and make them a colonist otherwise it'll take longer to convert her oh I see what you mean I, 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 I'll struggle to convert it'll take way too long she'll go berserk and uh, tear apart my whole colony before that happens I, I don't have anybody with decent social it's a neanderthal as well so Dr. New, you want a, bi a bionic penis on... You're, you're a little chick. I'm not putting a... I'm not wasting a bionic penis on a, on a little chick. There's no way. We need to... Uh, we need, like, a quest or something. Something's got to give. We need, like, uh, a, a pod... We need a new person. We need a new person that can do research. Would be nice, right? Because currently our only... We got level 4 research, just NyQuil89, who has already got a million other jobs to do. Too many advanced components for a bionic penis. Oh, NyQuil89's working on it. 14% chance the tame failed. Does that mean that NyQuil89 is gaining... Uh, oh yeah, some social. But does that come under animals? K96 is considered an animal? Yeah, the kid was drawing on the floor, yeah. 24 more days for Ultramunka? Unless she goes into labor. And then I think she can get past it. Oh, it falls under handling. Handling isn't even a thing here. So this is an animals? Taming, training, and controlling. So it is animals. It says taming right there. We're taming. No, no, she's not pregnant. Have a panic room pass all the chickens so the raiders have to survive thousands of pecks to kill everyone? I don't know if the chickens aggro onto the raiders, though. I'm not sure that that's how chickens work. Yeah, 
Yeah, this is a te temperate forest, yeah. It's a temperate temperate forest biome. Biome? Biome. A biome. Okay, well, I guess we can put some floors down, right? Uh, although, maybe let's start trying to move some people out. Where do we want to move them to, though? This is going to look um, weird before um, it starts to look anything but, but weird, right? I, we can't really start building into the mountain just yet, though, because I don't really want to deal with an infestation like how we are now. I think we'd be dead. I think it'd be too much. So where the heck could we put um, some little living quarters? I mean, we don't need this many chicks. We could probably try to sell them all. Put them at the back, maybe? We could probably put them at the back. Dark Buddhists will be upset if mining occurs. Who the heck is a Dark Buddhist? Ultra Manga? Yeah, what the heck? Well, who's a Dark... Who in this um, colony is currently a Dark Buddhist? Want human meat. Man, we need an exorcist in here for Ultra Monka. What is going on here? Learning starved. No blood feeders. Want human meat. God, this is not going to end well, right? She's not, she's not actually a oh, K96. It's happened. Battle stations, everybody. Ramsey 8, let's go. It's a Neanderthal. Oh. Okay, let's capture K96, I guess. Who went berserk? Food. Maybe we could have fed uh, Ultra Monka. Alright, well, we can try doing the convert, I guess. K96 has is, has a frail torso and hearing loss in both ears. <coughs> Excellent. Really nice. Zone remove roof area. Just deaf as a post. Yeah. Dilly dee 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 do 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 do. I mean, we could just put them back here, actually. Structure. Slate wall. Yeah, maybe we just do it like this. One. Two. Three. That fits okay for now, I think. Put them on the outside. Get rid of that, too. Alright. Structure. Let's get some wooden doors up in here. Let's 
gonna take a little while because Nyquil is uh, down for the count. Twelve, buckle your shoe. You what, mate? You what? You what, mate? Oh, we're still trying to tame uh, K96, but actually we just want to do a convert first, right? Wild Meadow, it's going to take a little while to uh, to do the convert. Do 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 How much um we got a little tiny bit of herbal medicine, but we're out of normal medicine almost. We got three left. So it looks like we're gonna be relying on the um herbal medicine. So we should probably try to get some and maybe plant some as well. We got loads of rice now, so we can actually zone shrink zone. Zone, growing zone. Let's get a couple of, um, let's get a couple of heal roots up in this. What am I aiming for? I just want to be. I just want to sustain. I want to sustain and then leave on the spaceship. I guess it's been a while. <laughs> we got visitors. A group from Assen. Okay, here we go. Luza Porcupine Kamabenla, great chief of nation of Gorarna, is requesting a favor. Her friend Manatee Robrebrio is interested in learning about other cultures, and she wants you to host him at Chase's Gigantic Prostate for 13 days. Uh, Robrebrio will not do any work, but we could get a telescope and some plasteel, or a steel gladius masterwork, and 40 uranium. Or a hand talon and a mind screw. The mind screw inflicts continuous pain on the user. Would have been nice to put one of those into chase at the time. Uh, hand talon is like Wolverine claws. I think we could get the telescope and the plasteel. Sure, why not, right? A mind screw. Sure. Okay. Pods have arrived. Whoa. All right, this guy is just visiting. He wants to see how other cultures work. The tribal database? I'll accept it, but I'm not going to actually do anything. More visitors? They got a couple items to trade as well. Okay, NyQuil is feeling okay now, so might actually get some of these construction jobs done. <laughs> Here he is, the man of the hour. The man with the power. The man with all the construction skills in the colony. This guy is like a bulldozer with a wrecking ball attached. He'll leave rings around your eyes. How many chicks? Oh my god, like a million chicks. I wonder if these guys want to buy any of these chicks. 
Let's get Ramsey 8 out here. You guys want to buy some chicks? No. They want to buy this, uh, these awful weapons, though. Plain leather cowboy hat. Sid thread pants normal for a hundred bucks. 141 bucks. We can buy their herbal medicines. We've done it. Two bucks for all the weapons. I know. Well, they were just like crappy, crappy raider weapons. They're all like really bad quality and low percentage and stuff. We might just have to murder all these these chicks soon, right? It may just go that way. What happened down here? So much, so many links. Oh, do we have any uh, boomalopes? No, we still don't. It's all boom rats. It's all just little boom rats. I don't know if we're making any pro progress on this convert, but I guess the thing is, it's just like, it's social XP, right? Oh. <laughs> My face. Alright, K96 is fully healed. Man, maybe we just release. Let's just, uh, let's just execute. Fuck it, let's just release her, who cares? Maybe she'll leave the map as well. She's eating up all my food, I don't even want her. I'm, let I'm letting you go, K96, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. This is not the one. I promise I'll be good. It's too late. Growth tier 2? There, look. Okay, K96 is escaping. What? Uh oh. Oh, she's wise to the traps. Off she goes. Off she rides into the sun, un, into the sunset alone. Will she leave the map? There you go. She's gone. Oh, thank Christ! Another problem dealt with. Animals. Wildlife. There was another dude out there at one point, but I don't think he's out there now. I think he's long gone. Now our guys get a mood debuff? Why? Oh, colonist prisoner escape. Wait, she wasn't part of our colony though. We we set her to release. How's she, how did she escape? Oh my god. Like every chicken has the flu. <laughs> oh man. Well, it was. I'd say it was fun. It wasn't really, though. Look at all the nutrition consumption that's happening in here. We were due a big. Oh, look, it's because all the chicks turned into adults. <laughs> oh my god. They're all big birds now. Doctor knew you're gonna be a good soldier. Man, we need some people. Where are they? 
Hey, look at this guy. It's a little talking rat out here. Oh, nice. They finished all this. Very good. All right. Let's start getting some people moved in here. We'll get some floors in here, too. We can make this, the floors out of uh, slate or limestone. Let's go for a bit of limestone, sure. There's a rabbit in the house? Oh, yeah. God, it's cold out. It's one degree. Well, maybe we can get to a point where these people aren't getting pissed off every time somebody moves in the room that they're trying to sleep in, right? Shiny tree above the graveyard? What graveyard? We don't even have a graveyard. Oh, this one. Oh, this. I don't know what it does. I think it's like some sort of like prayer tree. It does something, but I've never used it before. Power. We need power. Someone's frozen? Who? Rob Rubio. This guy is just, uh, he's just visiting. He's just a visitor. Now I have to lick the tree. I will not be licking the tree. I'm sorry, but if you think I'm going to be licking that tree, you're in for a big surprise because I am not going to do it. Wooden bed. Let's get a dresser. Let's get a wooden end table. Let's get a wall light. Let's get this power installed first so we can actually see if it reaches. Uh oh. Harrowing edifice. Stellarch Honorios Glabus of the Exodus Empire is requ we're requesting that you build a monument to commemorate the origins of his brothers. 4x5 in size. Glitter World Medicine, 3 Honor, or 31 Hyperweave. Yuck. Those rewards suck. I wouldn't even get out of bed for those rewards. You call that payment? And then I have to have a crappy monument inside my cool base for like 30 days for for like 20 pieces of hyperweave. That sucks. How does Ultra Monka have hypothermia? I guess it's like six degrees in here. There. warming up a little bit in here now. It's minus two outside. I have a passive cooler. Oh yeah, I need to get rid of this thing. All right. We have 121 watts excess. We have enough wood probably to get another generator going. It would be nice to get a couple of boomalopes, though. Everybody died in the migration, yeah, sadly. They all starved to death.
And your baby died in the soup on the previous tile? Well, no, the baby, the baby made it out of that, of the tank. No problem, didn't die in the soup. The people of Guman are attacking immediately. Godfarda Pizza. These are Neanderthals, though, and I don't know if the traps stop them. Five traps might not stop his ass. These things are beefy. Never mind. It worked. Maybe we just gotta get friendly with the, the Neanderthals so they don't attack us. Try to raise our relationship with them. We can use a transport pod to send them toxic ways. Could be nice. Yeah, I, we sleep in these bed clusters IRL, yeah. We all sleep in a bed and then the baby sleeps on the, uh, on the bedside table. I don't know what the hell we're going to do when she gets too big to sleep on that thing. I don't know how you do a five bed cluster. Human centipede beds. Why, that's the, why do you have to say that? Why do you have to bring up the human centipede? It's so gross. Why'd you have to do it? Centipede beds. Yuck. I don't care much for that. It's nice with the limestone uh, brickwork on the floor, though, no? Looking pretty, pretty, pretty good. Stop the meds on the chickens? Oh shit. Are they are they using all my meds on these chickens? They better not be. Colony animal. Oh lord. Okay. <laughs> Doctor care with no medicine. Same with neutral um animals as well. Jesus. Okay, good, 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 good. All right, so let's give a bed to NyQuil89. Let's give a bed to Ramsey8. Because these are the original ones, right? So we got to look after them first. So Shady Lurker needs to have the last bedroom. Have I learned to appreciate eggs yet? Uh, no. Okay, set owner, Shady Lurker 01. Wonderful. We're nearly there. 
all the kids are going to have to sleep in this st stupid fucking garden shed that we built out here. Oh, yeah, look at that. It's decent, somewhat poor, average size, neutral, and clean. That's like a, like a Premier Inn. It's like a Premier Inn room. You ever stayed at the Premier Inn before? <sighs> oh, I'm so tired. And you've never stayed at a Premier Inn before? Oh my god. You are missing out. What a wild ride that place is. Um, we'll probably need to get some uh, temperature stuff in here too, right? Let's get some overwall vents. Do, do, do. I didn't change the meds on the chicks, I only changed the defaults. Nice. All right, let's go get some more medicine. McDonald's would be proud of me? Tell you what. Why aren't they uh, re sowing? Is it too cold out? 10 degrees? Oh no, he's doing it. Nikel 89's doing it. Ramsey 8's doing it. Ramsey 8's uh, gardening skills have only gone up a tiny bit. Will he plant this stuff, I wonder? NyQuil 89. Let's see. No. Heel root. Mad foot sandwich. It's just a little rat. Nice. Oh yeah, he has started planting it. Great. I'm worse than Ramsey Bolton. Jesus. Worse than that psychopath? Do you really believe that? Do, 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 do. Ramsey Bolton also removed a cock from an idiot. Wait, what was the guy's? Was it Theon? Theon Greyjoy. He was never quite the same again after he had his cock removed. He used to, he used to reek, that's right, yeah. Man, that was such a fucked up storyline. You wouldn't be the same either? If they cut if they cut off your wiener you'd still be able to kind of like pee out of like uh like the tube though <laughs> like the little the little connector tube in there how would that work though would you do <laughs> like where how would you do it you'd have like a piss stump yeah oh god i don't know if i would like that
You wouldn't like that. I don't think I would either, actually. I don't know if I would appreciate having a having a piss stump. Well, I mean, it depends, though, right? I think I'd still rather be alive, though, you know? <laughs> Lord Barris has entered the chat. Just a, he's just a Ken doll. He's got, he's got fucking, uh, he's got his underpants uh, grafted to his skin. He's got a little, little mound down there. Chickens have a piss stump. What the hell are you talking about? What are you talking about? What you talking about? <laughs> Do we do you think maybe it's time to expand the hallway out just a tiny bit just to keep us a little bit safer? I think it is, you know. Cuz if there's Neanderthals around, which I believe there are, we're going to need to uh Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's the one. Nice. You could put one in the corner, but they skip the ones in the corner. They can come they can uh they can diagonal through, right? So there's not much point in having them there. They always get missed. sending your mates around. Stop making the garbage kill box. Well, I don't know how to make any other ones. Nobody really plays this game anymore. I tried to look up examples, and there's like one example that like some Chinese think tank put together. And uh, it has like fucking like uh, stools that people stand on to shoot over people's shoulders and stuff like that. But there's no... That's it. That's the only one. The singularity. Yeah, I know. I don't want to build that. But then I've never seen any other examples of just like, you know. I don't know. This works for like the early stuff. It's fine. Be a thought leader in your field. It's fine, it works. I just want it for like manhunter packs and like, uh, you know, just like tribal raids or whatever. And like, later on when they start turning up with like uh, bazookas and, and whatever. Yeah, I know it's not going to work, but you know, it'll slow them down a little bit, I guess. Fence at the top. You usually have a path with turrets either side in alcoves. I don't, I can't get turrets and alcoves to work. They always just get aced and then they 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 sizzle and blow up all the walls. Which I hate that. I hate when they blow up all the walls. I spend so much time building those damn walls just for them to be blown up. It drives me crazy. That drives me nuts. Ultra Monka is still in bed here for 14 days. Oh my god. Ultra Monka had a growth event whilst bedridden. Blogus should have one pretty soon though, right? Six? There you go. One more year to go for Blogus. Blogus will get a, a, a growth event as well. A fence is needed at the top of the murder maze? Where? Oh yeah, that one there. So yeah. I just seen it. Royal tribute collectors here? Do 
Do do. Look up Francis John Killbox. He had a really good video on how to make the best one for whatever scenario. All right, I'll see if I can find it later. I'll, I, I, I watch stuff like normally in the evening or whatever. I'll see if I can find one. I, again, though, I, 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 I don't think this one is... I know it's not the, the best, but like... Jeez, it doesn't have to be the best. It just has to work for a bit, right? Um, should we make another room? Ew. Whoever is in this room is going to be so pissed because all you're going to hear is like people dumping bodies in here all night long. I had a great kill box last time I played RimWorld. Just remember what I did back then? Didn't I just do something similar to this? I'm sure I did. I'm sure it was like pretty close to this. I think we need a we need a, a longer we need to like extend it out though right you need to like kill them over here and then have a long path for them to come down that we can then use turrets to shoot at them with <clears throat> this this one's just a temporary one for now right we're just doing this one temporarily Can he actually get in here? Oh yeah, he can. He can do it. Floors, limestone tile. Yeah, it's fine. I think it I think it's fine for early game. I agree. We don't have anywhere to shoot and stuff when they get out of here because <clears throat> we just don't have anybody who has a decent gun or shooting skills or anything to begin with, right? We got to get some research done. We haven't done any yet. The Singularity kill box does look insane, yeah. I, don't, I still think that... Um, I think uh, I think what people tend to do is they build in a mountain, right? Like they would build like all their stuff in here, and then they'd have the singularity kill box like in the one possible place that they could get in, and then it can kind of handle everything. Because even even if you make it, if you make the kill box underneath overhead mountain, you can't get potted nothing, right? You can't get mortared. But yeah, people hate mountains because of the bugs. <clears throat> I think they just deal with the bugs, you know? Drop pods are not the best, yeah. You can just disable bugs if you want to, yeah. I would feel... I would feel... Like I was cheating if I disabled the bugs, you know? I like to play with as many of the intended settings as possible. In fact, uh, wh what have we turned off? I think the only annoying things we've overcome with is with mods, but even our mods aren't overly, like, game-breaky ones. I don't know. It's It's whatever. It's whatever floats your boat, you know? It is five degrees outside, though. Maybe we should think about getting um, some heaters. Whatever bloats your scrote. Whatever floats your... Whatever, whatever you want. Whatever you like. Whatever you need, whatever you choose, 
hey, it's your choice. Whatever you win, whatever you lose. Oh yeah, and we need a, a wall light here too, right? Nice. <coughs> Thought about a pacifist colony? Yeah, well, you'd, you'd need to tame uh, animals, right? To help you with that. I think we need another uh, generator here as well, right? Power. Get another wood fired. Plenty of wood around here. We're, we're in a forest after all. Pacifist uh, means that you can't do any uh, fighting yourself, but you can train animals to fight for you and defend you. And you can build turrets and stuff too. <clears throat> no, the animals are not pacifist. You just use like traps and turrets and animals. Have I thought about a blind nudist colony that smokes weed all day? <laughs> Have I thought about that? My only shower thought for like the longest time has been that. Just thinking about how awesome that would be. Not even in game. <clears throat> you don't think pacifism is getting other things to kill for you? Okay, sorry. So Sorry for breaking the code or, or whatever. I don't know. I'm not like the... Uh, you know, I, I'm not like the foremost authority on modes in this game. I'm just telling you what I thought it was. No, I'm not, funnily enough. What do you do? Do you just, in past you just lock yourself in a, in a mountain when the bad guys come and wait for them to leave? <clears throat> you build a decoy town for them to burn down every time. Pastor's colony is you just die to the first raid, and you you pee and poop poop your pants. Well, I'm pretty good at doing that. Peeping, peeping, and pooping. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm so flimmy. Where the hell are all the uh, events? Like, uh, where are all the quests? Where? Uh, I guess I guess the 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 random Randy we got this time was uh, one that just doesn't want to uh, do anything in the game. Randy just fell asleep. <clears throat> this Randy just sends chickens. I know. So far, all Randy has done is send us like a million chickens. And then a million chickens and then a raid of one person with a spike bat. He popped up a message earlier and he said two sex. I gotta go pick up my kids from school and uh, have some lunch and go to the bathroom and do a million other things. <clears throat> yeah, it could be toxic fallout though. Maybe this is it. Maybe this is his way of saying, I'm not gonna send much to you, but when I do, it's gonna be toxic fallout. <laughs> All right. Let's trade with these guys. See if they got anything. Don't come through here with your animals. They got some ducks. Um, they have a, um, they got a bear called Chesterton 222. It's, it, they want 936 bucks for it. Which is crazy because I could only sell them for like 400 bucks last game. So they get double? They sell it for double? Or is it because I have such a low um, social skill on this one, this guy? We're getting some, we're getting some bad, bad prices. It's called economics. It's a bear market. 
a nice kidney for sale. I don't need any kidneys right now. I don't. I think everybody, everybody's got as many kidneys as they need in this uh, in this place. Blogus, what are you doing? What's your problem? Why won't Blogus sleep in this room? Why why won't Blogus sleep up there? He hates the room. Oh, you know what? You're right. He does it is a we forgot to expand the allowed area for safety, right? To include these new safe rooms. Holy crap, half the freezer wasn't in the zone either. Unreal. Okay, now we can set the owner to Blogus. He's in. Okay. How the hell old is Blogus again? He's Oh yeah, he's going to have a growth moment any any minute now. He's going to turn 7. Ultra Munka is um about 2 years off becoming a fully grown ass adult and has spent all of her childhood in bed with a disease so that's not been that's not been the best honestly limestone tiles 492 tiles required it's gonna be our it's gonna be our biggest build yet They did get the super immune trait, yeah. You just watched the Singularity kill box? I should definitely try it. It does look insane, doesn't it? But yeah, that's the only one I can really find. Oh, and there's the other one, the burn box one. Where they have that that gigantic like coil of... That looks like maybe wooden barricades, I think. In like a roofed snaking corridor. And then they use an incendiary launcher to light it all on fire, and then everything inside gets toasted. That one works great. Is that what people like to use? Is that sort of like the go-to now in this game? Way too try hard. Doo, 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 doo. I don't think we need to worry too much about um, this collapsing, right? Especially if I just remove the roof area. Oh yeah, there's a little bit of potential collapse here. I think they'll leave one up though, or maybe they won't. Those beds are try hard with this with the with the swirly thing. Do you actually think that that is a bit too much? I thought it was fine, honestly. Swirly, swirly beds. Well, maybe I maybe I'm slowly becoming a big tryhard. I mean, I'm I've been playing the game a lot. You know, maybe um maybe I will get interested in that side of the game. You know, being like really efficient. Did I drink my hot dog dog juice this morning? For breakfast? You know I did. No, no breakfast is complete. No morning is complete without it. That greasy 
hot dog juice you ever have you ever looked at hot dog juice in a clear glass before and you see like that greasy film on top on the top of the liquid nine nine don't lie you've you've done it you you do it every day you're doing you're doing it right now studying it and licking your lips drooling everywhere You're making hot dogs right now? Oh shit. Oh man. Zone. Remove a roof area. Okay, good. Th this is not overhead mountain. So we can get rid of this whole thing. We gotta start clearing out this area, right? If we wanna have a long corridor for them to go through so that we can set up turrets and stuff that I have not even started researching yet. No, no, I'm saying. A shuttle has arrived. Oh, it's it's here to pick up uh, our guest. Bye. Nice. Why did they drop it out there? They could have dropped it inside. No, would have been nice. They just dropped it outside. You're guzzling dogs left and right? God, I wish I was. We just don't have enough people to do all this hauling, right? Our last colony before the toxic fallout stuff was was starting to, to run fairly well before we were rudely interrupted. Boomlope's on the map? Really? Oh, shit, you're right, there is. Okay, let's see if we can tame Erica. Okay, Shady Lurker successfully tamed Erica. <laughs> nice. That's pretty good. All right, sweet. Good job, Shady Lurker 01. We got a dog named Shady Lurker 01 and a, and a colonist named Shady Lurker 01. That's crazy. Okay, so Erica is a male boomalope. We'll try to get another one. Lost Soul 44. See? If Shady Lurker can do it again. Let's also make sure that there's no, um, <laughs> no wood on this side in case one of these guys, um, goes big, right? We don't want that to happen. Great. That's great. Got all this granite here, too. I didn't realize we had so much granite. Bills. Uh, add a bill. Make granite blocks till we have 150 details of which yeah keep shady lurker busy with crafting crafting seven it's not going up with the uh with the stone cutting Stone cutting doesn't count towards uh, skill ups, sadly. So nutrition consumption is 0 0.86. And growth is 3.52. If we get three boomalopes, then we can have 
4,000 watts of power from the uh, from four of those um, chem fuel um, things, right? Milk fullness. Math. Yes, I'm a math major. Yes. Um, you see, um, the 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 Bumalo milk um, makes approximately uh, seven seven point nine two three liters of milk, and of course the chem fuel generator only needs um, thirty chem fuel per cycle. Three, not 30. Make sure you tame all the same gender. I think it's three for four. Or maybe it changed, though. Maybe did it change? Is it three for three? One, one boomalope per generator? Or is it like one boomalope for 1.25 generators? Just sterilize. We don't need to. As soon as we get a chem fuel in, boom, we're going for it. We're going to stop burning wood. You meant don't have too many boom loaves? No, I don't want to have too many. You're right. I just want like two for now. Two, two is enough for me. Oh, look at that. Look at all that delicious fuel. Okay, let's dismantle this log burner. And then instead, we'll get a chem fuel powered one in. Fill it up with some of the good stuff. Good job, NyQuil. Oh, yeah. There we go. Looking good, looking good. Oh. You love all the meals on the ground? Yeah, I don't know why they keep doing this, actually. There's there's 10 meals already, and then there's just like a billion meals on the ground here. I don't get it. It says that we have 13 meals out of 10, and, and yet they still just sit here plowing away. It's weird, isn't it? They can't put the meals in the fridge since the stack is full and they can't fuse it with the other stack. So they just keep dropping on the ground and making more? That doesn't make sense. I thought we downloaded like three mods to make um, our colonists not be so fucking stupid. And yet every time I look into something that they're doing, yep, you guessed it, they're being really fucking stupid. A refugee chased by Yatakin. Two drifters. A 66-year-old hearth tender named Frey is calling from nearby. He's being chased by Yatakin from Whittacle family. He begs for safety and offers to join you at Chase's gigantic prostate. Frey? You might be the, the person that we need. Everybody, be safe. Frey has joined. Frey is an underground... <laughs> okay. You know what? This might not be so bad, though. Because, yeah, Frey is an undergrounder. We're planning on living underground at some point, right? And an amazing cook. And look at the medical on Frey. And some good shooting, too. All right. Kind of slow, though. Might not even make it. The, J Jardim's is using some bullshit colon... He's dead. He's actually just fully dead. It's It was the, it was the frailness that did it. <laughs> just couldn't run. Just couldn't outrun them. <laughs> I love the fucking bestial vigor. 
<laughs> they don't even want to. Okay, sure. Well, it happened. Blogus got some tattered apparel. Um, Blogus, you got some kids' clothes on? I can't help with that. Oh, man. Well, there you go. We tried to get a new colonist. It did not work out. Why didn't I help him? I don't know. Everybody's asleep. I mean, by the time they got out there, it wouldn't have mattered. Uh, he he managed to make it like three steps from where he spawned in. Time for a party because we, we dodged a bullet there. He would have just been upset the whole time about being an undergrounder, right? You know that he would have just been so pissed the whole time. It's not worth it. And he didn't have any uh, any intellect skills, right? He was just kind of like going to come in and, and pretend that he's like the next Shady Lurker 01, but we already have a Shady Lurker 01. We don't need another one. I don't have any intellect skills either. Yes, thank you, 99. I also, I noticed you misspelled intellect, but I guess it's just one of those, you know. It's one of those ones. He had a good heart. He had a good heart, but a frail back. A kill box. I, wait, wait, I know. Don't, don't, don't come in here and judge my kill box, okay? We just started. It's, it's fine. It, it, it's, it, it's killing animals mostly that try to wander into the base and stuff. It doesn't, it, it's not the finished article, okay? Once I got the nuclear power up and running and everything, we'll, we'll make a better one. Hey, Putty the Gamer, thanks so much for the five gift subs. I appreciate it. Thanks so much. Oh, you meant me talking about my burn. Not my actual kill... Oh, sorry. I thought you were judging my kill box. I know it's not the best kill box, but... Like I keep saying, it, it, it works for what we needed to do right now. Was the main thing, right? It allows me more time to just um, kind of um, pan, pan around the map a lot and look at things. And wait for stuff to happen. We got a lot of food. For once. We got we've got medicine. Maybe we can even like cut down on some of the food here a little bit since the rice grows so fast and we can start growing some uh some cotton. I'm down. Just a little tiny bit. Doesn't have to be much. A growing zone. Okay, in this new growing zone, guess what? That's right. It's cotton. We just need a little bit, right? <clears throat> Good job, NyQuil89. I, honestly, NyQuil89, if NyQuil89 was our only colonist, everything would get done. Except for the times where he's been injured. He's been injured a couple of times. <laughs> hey, we finally finished the floor. It's very impressive, somewhat rich, quite spacious, neutral, and slightly dirty. We've come a long way. 
All right. We gotta research. My next priority is, of course, to research auto doors. <laughs> Nine Nine's favorite move. He loves that one. This room is exactly the same as you. Slightly impressive, somewhat rich. Uh, what was the other? Clean. Sterile. Morbidly obese. Don't forget tree sowing in a forest. Another one of my great greatest moves. I love tree sowing in a in a in the middle of a forest. Well, I feel like I learn a bit every time. I know I've played enough of this game, but I I played it a long time ago. And I forgot most of the stuff, and this time around, I feel like, you know what? I'm, I'm learning from my mistakes a little bit. Except for last week. Last time didn't count, it was the toxic fallout that I wasn't ready for. I wasn't ready for that toxic fallout. Toxoid ra wasters have turned up. It's one man with a gun. Okay, everybody is currently enjoying the safety of the base right now. Anyway, we don't need to uh, to change that. God, it's minus one outside though. Holy crap! Is it nice and warm in these bedrooms? It is. Wait, you might need to get some parkas going. <laughs> okay, toxoid wasters have begun their assault. Oh, Petite Krungo. Hey, this guy's got intellectual and crafting. He's a genie with 12 mining. Oh, man. This is a good worker. We could get this guy in as a nice worker, right? Petite Krungo. Petite Krungo. Uh, he's unwaveringly loyal, though, unfortunately. Um, all right. Let's just harvest his organs. Randy's teasing me. I know, that would have been so good. Quest available. Adronos the Desperate. A desperate refugee named Adronos is approaching. Adronos claims to have lost his home in a recent attack. Adronos begs you for permission to for permission to stay at Chase's gigantic prostate for six days so he can rest and regroup. In return, he offers to work and fight for free during that time. If you make him happy, he may offer to join you. He may also reward you later for helping him, but there is no way to know his true intentions. Alright, let's get him in. Let's see what, what, what he can do. Adronos. Also known as Jaffa Party. He's got intellect and artistic. He's a he's a baseliner. He's psychically de deaf. He's nimble and ugly. Okay. We can put him to work. That's fine. Maybe we can actually get some research done while he's here. Maybe we just use him as... Maybe we just use him as... Um, like a full-time researcher, man. Where can we get some research going? Nine point four fuel. Work. This guy can do some backup doctoring. Bed rest, hall plus, child care, he's got no skills in that. Handling, he's got six skills. Cooking, he can do some cooking. I think let's just get him on cooking, art, and research.
Then you can do, um... I mean, cooking... Cooking you won't have to do much of, honestly. Art, we're not really set up for, but it would be good to get start getting some art done. Um... Sure. Unowned, 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 unowned. Un Where is, uh, oh, Ultramunka will need a bed. Okay, that's fine. We can, uh, let's uninstall some of these beds. And, uh, we can uninstall this too. <coughs> Ultramunka, we need to, uh, uninstall your your bed here too and move you to the other bed hope you don't mind how do we move um... okay perfect the, do the dog the dog holder perfect okay production um, an art bench and we also want a simple research table. Perfect. All right, what are we researching first? Some batteries? Oh wait, no, auto doors first, right? And then tree sewing? Michael 89 what are you doing, man? We want the ace on, on this. We want the new guy to be doing this. Where the hell is the new guy? Oh, he's hauling. What's he doing? Hey, maybe this guy will decide to stay. He might not, though, right? Blogus1225 has become seven years old. Construction or melee? Already has three melee. Jealous, gourmand, nudist, or psychically deaf? I guess psychically deaf is pretty good. He won't get a f he won't be affected by the um by the uh, the drones and stuff but then won't be able to do it, have any psychic powers either Yeah, it is kind of the only good choice in this one, isn't it? Construction or melee? Probably melee, right? And then eventually he can learn to uh to fight. Gourmand is so annoying. Choose one skill. Okay, sure. Done. Melee it is. All right, Jaffa Party's researching. He's re researching up a storm. Look at his intellect. Climbing up. Okay, Petit Krungo. Let's um, harvest um, some kidneys lungs and then probably like a liver or a heart nice okay one all right the toxoid wasters do not like the fact that petite krungo is being organ harvested two men with guns have turned up We're ready to rock and roll, though. Schedule. Safety first, everybody. <laughs> Don't poggers the, that the bad guys have turned up. They're not going to rescue your ass. You got your down one kidney. What are you going to do? Just plug it back in? You're, you're leaving here in a body bag. This is where you're going to live.
Okay, they've begun their assault. Ow. Ow, ow, ow. All right, they're dead. Nice. Good job, everybody. Good job. All right, Petit Krongo, whenever you're ready. Um, let's queue you up for a, um, a, a lung harvest. Oh, nice. She's pregnant. Ooh, Krungo. Holy shit, you're right. Yeah, second trimester. Okay. If we hold on to, to Petit Krungo and she gives birth, can we recruit her baby? We can just keep the baby. <laughs> well I don't think you need uh, I think you only need one lung and one kidney for a childbirth though I've seen it happen three times now I'm not a medical man by any means but I could tell by the way that my, my wife was like really acing it that she could have probably been down a couple of organs for it and still would it, it would have been fine. <laughs> oh man. Oh, that got me. <laughs> That's I'm just laughing at my own sheer stupidity right now i love that oh <laughs> this is a new one yeah mm. oh. just a few organs later well those are the ones that you can get those are the ones you get away with the heart i mean we could um Fuck, we could get we could give her some peg legs as well, right? Just to make sure she doesn't leave. All right, we better do that. We'll get the peg legs on and then off. The <laughs> 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 crisis, the timing on that. Pity Krungo's spirit is broken. I mean, I guess this is what is gonna happen. Oh no. I guess it it was bound to happen with, with everything that's been going on. Alright. First peg leg. Stall. Uh oh. No, it actually failed. NyQuil 89 hit 10 doctoring. That was pretty nice gonna have to try again just a couple of that's fine it's fine okay let's uh let's give it another go just take the other so we gotta try again well yeah you gotta, you gotta try if it, if at first you don't succeed you know what they say try try again Cassowary sitting. Apabringus. The Baroness of the Exodus Empire is making a request. She wants you to take care of two cassowaries that chases gigantic prostate for seven days. The cassowaries are Appa's favorite pets. She wants them to see the world outside her royal court. We get a thin body gene pack or five glitter world medicine or a measly two honor. It's seven days to look after two birds. You don't want a cassowary in my pen? What about... Okay, but what about two cassowaries?
the rewards aren't great, but like I'll take five good world medicines. Sure, why not? Okay. Oh my god, they're big. Holy shit, they're walking through all the traps as well. What the heck are these things thinking? Can they even go in here? <clears throat> we'll find out when they wake up, right? They're just gonna wander around? It's Bone Dead and Doctor New. You can't train them. You could probably release them. Animals? Oh, yeah, you can put them in there. What the hell? Oh, Shady Lurker's got to do it. It's fine. It's just the... Whoa, Jaffa Party. You sure about this? It's pretty dark in there. It worked. Okay. I just got to get the right peg leg in. Here we go. Put them safely in the pen. Get this intruder out of here. I don't know who let this guy in. Did he self-tame or something? No. Get out of here. Oh, we got another boomalope, too. Look at this. All right. Nutrition, consumption, and growth is still... Levels are nominal. Oh, shit. Look at this. We got... Now we can get rid of this one, too, and replace it with, a, uh, with another one. Risky shooting? I know. I like to live my life on the absolute edge. Perfect. That's great. All right. Load it up with some of the good stuff. Here we go. A rare thrombose has arrived. We still got plenty of food. Now we got tons of medicine. Well, not tons, but enough. <sighs> enough to just sink uh, maybe the smallest of ships. Holy crap, I watched uh, Succession uh, last night, the third episode of the of Series 4. Man, it's crazy. It was a what a ride, eh? Okay, Pity, Pity Krungo now needs to have... Um, peg legs removed. Petit Krungo has just regained the ability to walk, which is what we're hoping was never going to happen again. Uh oh. She's up. Everybody's asleep. She's puking everywhere. Oh my god. It's airtight in there. She's going to be up to her neck in it. She's drowning in puke. Don't worry. Here's some more food for you to puke up after. I don't know why we got to use medicine to to remove a peg leg. Oh, you just unscrew it. Oh, well. <laughs> you, get, you get a free piece of wood. <laughs> the fucking details in this game, eh? <laughs> you get, like, one log of wood from it. Oh, man. Okay, perfect. Nice. Okay, Petit Krungo's not going anywhere, and we are going to get another colonist, thanks to Petit Krungo.
Yes, I took arm. I not I'm not taking arms. No. No, no. Just legs. Oh, battery's almost done. Or is done, sorry, I should say. All right, now that battery's done. Um, um, oh, oh gosh. Um, drug production? Smithing. Smithing? I think we have enough power for now. I think we're okay for power. For now. Let me get a couple of batteries <laughs> in here too. We'll use the the we'll pretend that the batteries are are a big cool wall. You can use beer bottles and wood as melee weapons? I did not know that. I guess if you're really desperate you could do that. Ultra Monka, are you ready to... 15 hours left. Oh my god. Ultra Monka is, is, is due to wake up. It's about to happen. Hey, where did we get 10, um, 10 medicine? Did they pick it up off the map or something? It's crazy. All right, do we have... There's a female boomalope out here called Hi-Fi Guitar Guy. We would have to sterilize it. But then we'd have three boomalopes. We currently have 2,000 watts of power. Grid excess stores 679. Oh, the Raiders had seven meds. Nice, nice. That's good. That's real good. Hmm, good. Hmm, good. Mighty good. Mighty good. Tastes good. Tastes good. Looks good. Looks good. It is good. Marine Corps. Never do what again? What, the kidnapping of Petit Krungo? Uh oh. Oh no. Oh no. I can't believe it. This guy just killed our kid. Oh my god. They just killed Blogus. How could you? Let's go, let's let the dog get him. Nice. Big dodge. Go tenches. Nice. Okay, well, Jaffa Party is dead, which means our research efforts have just been flushed down the toilet as well. But also, sadly, Blogus has died, which um, we were not expecting. All right, well, look at. Let's um. Let's dig a grave, <laughs> and put it right outside of where Blogus used to live. Let's dig a grave and put it here instead actually <laughs> we can always dig it up and move them later right if we have to 
What happened to Shady Lurker 01? His neck got bruised in the club. Replace his bed with a tomb? No, no. We have to reuse these. Um, what's her face is up now. Ultra Munka is 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 up and ready to uh, to experience life. We have to give this bed to Ultra Munka instead. I can't believe Blogus. Blogus was gonna be um, our big melee. Our big melee person. We were going to build him up. Okay, well, Ultra Monka now is learning. Heading into some growth tiers. Might be, she's got two years left before she graduates into being a, kind of an adult. Unbelievable. Ultramunka, what are you doing in here? Cleaning. Where did they put Blogus' little child body? Did one of the animals eat it? In the main room. Where? Oh, yeah. I see it. They put it in storage. It's a bit weird that they stored a child's dead corpse on the furniture like that. They did put him on the shelf, yeah. <laughs> okay, colonist corpses. All right, let's let's put him on ice for a bit. Before, before he starts rotting too much. Do a wake? Yeah, well, we'll do something. We'll do something for sure for Blogus. Once we dig the grave. And bury him. That, what a, that betrayal stung. That hurt. I wasn't ready for that. There's a version of that rim fridge mod that makes them act like shelves for three times stacks. All right. I thought maybe that would be in this one as well, but we just had to unlock some research or something. Barry Blogus. No, we can't do a funeral for him. We're just gonna have to move on. <laughs> oh, the mod was before the shelves update? And now we got all this, uh, now we got all this stuff. Well, at least everybody's got a place to sleep. For now. At least, right? Okay, good job, NyQuil89. I 
can't I can't believe it. What are we missing? Components? No, we haven't run out of components. Looks like we've probably run out of steel though. Okay. Petit Krongo is in the third trimester now. Yeah, it's a new it's a new colony. Hey, thanks for the ninety four months I Dunnykin. Ninety four months. Thank you so much. Alright. We'll try to mine up a bit of this steel. Oh man, it's it's a shame we had that betrayal. That guy was actually pretty good. He would have been a nice one to have. He would have been a good one to have around, I think. He did a betrayal and we had to shoot him in the kitchen. And he killed he killed Blogus as well. All right, we might actually get some batteries filled up soon. Child murder is not Pog. You're right about that. You're right about that one. Temporarily ban anyone that dies in the game. <laughs> oh, that'd be funny, actually. Who's the other Boomalope? The other Boomalope is Lost Soul 44. Both of you are in there just being milked. Wow, Ultramon could just learn shirt sh shirting, sh shirting, shooting too. I can't believe she just learned shooting too. <laughs> shooting, shooting too was learned. Furniture? Wooden shelf? Let's make a couple of wooden shelves. Let's make a couple of little shelvies. Where's your royal cocaine? I don't know. Last time I died to a far cloud inside chased this huge butthole because of you. I don't think I deserve a ban. No, fair enough. I mean... If anyone should have been banned, should have been Chase's huge butthole from creating such disgusting fart clouds. No, we don't have a religion leader. We're not. We're not really like uh, ready for religious stuff yet. We didn't get anyone with a uh, decent social as usual, so I don't really have anybody who can do like converting and shit like that. Yeah, 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 yeah. We are gonna we are gonna steal a baby from someone, which is kind of exciting, I guess. No, we're not gonna eat the baby. No way. Um, storage important. Clear all. Chem fuel. Link settings. Oh, pardon me. Storage. We don't want to store our chem fuel in there anymore. Oh no, Lost Soul 44 has the flu. Um. Okay, hang on a second. Lost Soul 44 health overview. Let's put you on that. Furniture. Let's get a couple of animal sleeping spots up here. 
Nice. It's just minor flu. I'd probably make it. Preg leg. This whole this whole line with Petit Krongo is so weird. It's a weird one for sure. Doodle doo. Zone, remove roof area. Ignore roof area. I chose it. No, I did not. It presented itself to me. But I did decide to go along with it. I, I mean, the thing is, we need people. So, and um, it would be really good to get a growth vat so that we don't actually have to, like, take care of the baby. Until it gets to a point where it can just haul and clean, much like Ultra Monk is doing now, and do some learning as well. We are stealing a pri Yeah! Chad alerted me to the fact that the, pr the prisoner was pregnante while I was um, quite happily just removing organs that she didn't need. But yeah, now we're gonna we're gonna remove from her the the ultimate organ. Yeah, it's a free child. Yeah, get some fertility procedures. So you don't have to rely on impregnations. Can't you put? Um, can't you? Um, can't you can do stuff without actually um, making your colonist pregnant, though, right? With the growth vats, can't you just put the the crap in there and it it'll grow the baby? The crap, <laughs> yeah. Space drone data hack. This is uh, we uh, eight hours. We don't have anyone who can hack. No, but I mean, if we make, um, we can make like, uh, a, like super soldiers, right? But I guess it's, it'd be kind of hard to do. But what happens if, um, you know, if we don't have growth vats, but may, what if we just use Petit Krungo like a growth vat, you know? Would all the babies come out with with uh, with with genie genes? They'd all come out as freaks. Right. Okay. Well, I, no, I'm mean just. I'm not saying I want to do that. You know, just in case a friend ever asks me a question like that. At least now I have the answer. So genie will be the dominant trait? All right, okay. So we can expect Petit Krungo's baby to be a genie baby, which means that uh, eventually we'll be able to get some research done in 13 years. All of this evil shit and I'm not eating them too. Hey, look at Nickers and Layla can get out of here. Good. Let's get them loaded up. <laughs> oh, no. One of the cassowaries called Knickers. No, it wasn't actually. Oh, it was. They just, they, it, like, like their actual names were that. 
But then the Twitch thing renamed them to people in chat. We did it. What did we get for that? Glitter World Medicine. That's it. Oh, well, at least we have some, I guess, now. You went to walk the dog and it looks like we've got a new start? Yeah, we lost the uh we lost the old colony, so we're just starting from scratch again. Once again. Starting from scratch. Hey, we're gonna get a whole bunch of cloth soon. Not a whole bunch. I'm lying. Just a bit. I like using this uh this thing here. It's good, isn't it? Zone. Let's get a growing zone in here. Um, and let's plant some um, dandelions. You can use Petit Krongo as a baby farm. Just constantly use anesthesia on her so she can't fight back and go berserk. Well, no, but she's um, she doesn't have legs. We took her legs off, so I don't know if um, if that helps. She can't go berserk with that. Okay, that's fine. Visitors. Oh my god. Don't let them in. We can't let them see what's been happening here. You don't want to look in here. That's for damn sure. And dark, our our deepest and darkest secret. Oh, look at all the camp fuel we got now. That's great. I think we do actually have enough to get another one of these things up and running. So two two boomalopes. Could you think we could do two for three, and then three for four? Because we seem to have an excess of camp fuel. These are these are pretty loaded right now. I don't know how much more steel I need, honestly. Um, I think we know we got to get uh, Nyquil back on to the um, research potentially. If he's got absolutely nothing else to do. Drop your gun. You did drop your gun. Holy crap. Why did you drop your gun, silly? Wait, we've only got two poor bolt actions? Somebody else pick it up? No? Where the hell did it... Oh, she does have it. Well, 
Why did why did she go in and hunt him with the knife? It's weird. That's weird. Fucking weird. That's fucking weird. Um, what, uh, what do, can horses, um, carry, uh, you know what, uh, let's just tame this, uh, alpaca here, Marin, Marin Zinc. Okay, we're gonna tame this alpaca. I think we gotta go start improving relations with some of our neighbors and maybe trade for some stuff. I don't know, maybe some of them have slaves or something that we can buy, I don't. Horses are great for caravans? Duckers is a sloth. Nice. Well, the dog is all tamed up, which is kind of good. Can do hauling and some other stuff. How, um, how's this flu ha going? Okay, good. I think we'll send Ultra Monka. <laughs> out to get some real world experience out on the road <laughs> Ultra Monka we're going to send you out on the road with some wares we're going to load you up so you can sell some of this stuff you will not die you'll be fine out there yeah, you're going to have you're going to have a, an alpaca with you. What could possibly go wrong? There, look. You got your own gun. You got your own gun now, too. Things, things pop off. You can pop off. Now how good will that be? Sometimes you imagine what it would be like to go in the sun with your baby. Keep it down in there, prisoner. <laughs> we don't want to hear any of this. God, good thing we didn't install a vent. Just be able to hear the ramblings the whole time. Sending him in with an alpaca? It's like the Minecraft tree. Exactly, yeah. That's, a, that's what we're going for. Because who do we have here? Look, we got... A worshipful village, a gold mining worksite, and a hunting worksite. But then up the road here, we've got Ease, the the Asin. That's where we're gonna send them. We're gonna send them with a whole bunch of shit. Tame a horse. What instead of the alpaca? Okay, we'll train. We'll we'll tame you, Giso. You can go with them. Uh oh, it's a low psychic drone, but no one making food. Yeah, no, we got shady lurker. Should be making some. We got food. Let's let's fully load up the freezers. Let's get twenty in there. Make a nutrient paste machine? They'll get mad. We're not uh, transhumanists. They'll they'll they don't want to eat that. They'll eat it at a push, but
Oh. It looks like we got the, uh, the alpaca. We're just gonna try and get this horse now as well. How are we for nutrient consumption? We should be fine, right? Oh shit, we harvested the cloth. We got enough to make some cloth dusters now. Good. NyQuil 89 still has his. Ramsey could use one. We got a lot of poor ones. We're going to take some of this crap with us. Maybe we just take the alpaca for now. Take the horse next time. But wait. Pretty Krungo is in labor. Oh my god. It's happening. Okay, the room is not very clean. But I still expected quality is, is pretty good. 71%. Okay. We're doing it in the dark. You if, if it'll be fine. Okay, also though, we do need somebody who can do Ramsey 8 can do some child care. Ultra Monka is just a child cannot do child care. Here it comes. Here comes the baby. It's born. Oh, nice. Um, we can adopt it. Nice. Okay, we're a bit low on baby food. We might have to make some. Bills, add a bill, make baby food times four. Do it until we have 20 baby foods. meals okay that's fine <laughs> uh, for, we need to make a little uh, baby crib where's the where's the baby crib okay Ramsey you're gonna look after this thing you can have it in your room It's Admiral Kiki, who's sleeping on a, um, uh, on a night table. It's a baseliner. Oh, I could have looked at the, at the, um, at the stuff first, right? Uh, the, ba the baby's crying now. Goo goo gaga. Okay, good. All right. Let's put him in here. Look, he's gonna be nice and warm in there. Temperature is incredible in there. We can get some air conditioning in there eventually too. Just gotta make some baby food. What do you need to make uh, baby food? Oh, just anything. It just needs one nutrition. No. Oh, she's training. You're not going to make some baby food? Oh, maybe she is now. 
Yeah, here he goes. This is the baby food here, isn't it? Okay, good. All right, Admiral Kiki. You'll be able to eat. The mother can feed the baby too? Wait. Yeah. She does have a lot of milk in her boobies. So Ramsey can actually feed... Cannot get mother to breastfeed Admiral Kiki. No lactating colonists are assigned to Admiral Kiki. Oh yeah, it's because she's a prisoner. We don't want we don't want prison. Don't feed the baby in the freezer. Come on now. Come on now. Don't leave the baby on the floor of the no. I don't think Ramsey 8 is actually very good at childcare. Beggars seek elms. 120 silver. Fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. I'm not giving those guys 120 silver. In fact, is this horse tamed yet? No. All right. You know what? I'll tell you what's happening. We're forming a caravan. We're going here. It's going to take 1.8 days. We're sending Ultra Monka. And we're going to take Mirazink. Excellent. Okay. What do we want to sell? Let's sell some of this crap. Look, there's all these corpses that we can... Okay, let's sell the kidney, the lung, and then some of these bad weapons. We've got a poor duster here that we can get rid of. Silver, a poor duster here too. It's still 135 bucks, potentially. Um, a poor lizard skin t-shirt. Okay, we sell this stuff, we'll be able to buy all sorts of awesome stuff, right? Let's also take, um, we can't take the bed, it weighs 30 kilograms, but we could take this wooden end table. That wouldn't push us up and over too much. Travel supplies. Five simple, take six simple meals and take a bit of rice. Don't take this medicine though. You'll be fine. You won't need medicine. We've got 4.1 days of food. Okay, go. Misk. Caravan hitching spot. Why are you hitching him up here? Oh my god, what a terrible spot to hitch. Alright, grab all the shit and let's go. Let's see if we can get a cool gun or something while we're gone. Nobody else is helping Ultra Monka pack up. Think of all the experience that Ultra Monk is going to get out there on the road, though. So much experience. He's just having a little kip before he finishes packing up. Still not gone. It's just still not gone. Oh. I think he's going. It looks like he might be leaving. Godspeed, young man. 
Don't get killed by this bear. Look at him go. Man, I'm I'm so proud. All right, he's off to visit Ease. He's taking a couple of things to to trade with him. And he was never seen again? Come on, don't be like that. Look. He's already made it almost to the road. I can see him. Has he made it to the road? Yeah, he's just made it to the road. He's just passed through that praying village. Ah, oh, look, he's on the road. No problem. He's going to be going turbo mode now. <laughs> he's straight off the road a little bit. Oh, he's going to have to sleep on the road. He's going too fast. Even a rat will kill him in a random event? No, no. He's got two shooting. What are you talking about? He'll be fine. Think of all that experience he's going to get out on the road. He's going to be at one with the road. Yeah, that's right. He's practicing to be a drifter. Uh-oh. Whoa. Thank God it just started raining. It's just this one... There's one more mad boom rat here. Whew. Good. Do 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 Okay, do you think we just put the legs on now and let her go? I think we probably do, right? I think it's time. Well, we can't keep her here. I mean, it's gonna... It's gonna take too long to... <laughs> to get the system online, you know? Gotta we'll have to like feed her the whole time. We could use a lung. We got one. A lung and a kidney. Ultra Monk is taking it <laughs> to town to trade it right now. <laughs> We're gonna get some decent money for that. Does she not have any skills? No, she's not uh she, she's um unwaveringly loyal. So we can't do anything with her. That's hence everything that's happened. You can make her a slave? I don't know if I can actually. Oh yeah, I can enslave. Wardens will threaten the prisoner to reduce their will. Once they have no will left, the wardens will enslave them. I only have 2.2 will. He made it! All right. Rice, berries, kidney, lung. Oh yeah. Sell all this junk that we don't need. The wooden end table for 17 bucks as well. 1,537 bucks? Heck yeah. You want to just buy a whole shit ton of yayo and take it back? Oh look, skill trainer intellectual. This could actually be good for us, right? And get one of these. Power claw, bionic stomach, bionic arm, elephant tusk. A psychic insanity lance. They got an, a normal steel warhammer. They don't have any any guns as such. 
Maybe we just grab an intellectual uh, skill trainer. Now we can harvest Ultra Monka's organs too. Skill trainer crafting is a great investment. Yeah, there's no guns. Jump packs though. Um, we don't really need anything else here. I think having a bison would be good. I don't know if I want a bison. 473 bucks for a bison? No thanks. Gene pack. Robust digestion. Hulk body. Wake up resistant. Word of joy, Psy trainer. Word of joy could be kind of good too, actually. Jump packs. A bionic cock. Mm. Skill trainer crafting. I need to get. Uh, I need to get some intellectual. Right. We need to start doing some research with the people that we have. So let's take that, and we'll take the rest of the silver back as well. Yeah. And then we can use the skill trainer on. Um, what's his face? Dr. Nyquil. Okay. Let's head back. He's on his way. He stopped for, for the night. Food's going to rot. It's all right. He can forage on the way back. It's not a. It's not a. Uh, it's not a long journey, is it? Admiral Kiki is eleven days old already. Can you believe it? Already such a big baby. They grow up so fast. They really just do grow up so fast. We have more uh, mouths to feed now. And the food stocks, whilst they're doing well, they will begin to dwindle at some point, right? We need to get some hydroponics going. I wonder, actually, if we use this as, like, this area to get some of this stuff up quickly. But then we have, like, a, another area... Where we're just growing like some some slow corn, <laughs> you know. Just get like a big old area of slow corn, just to mix it up a bit. Four hundred percent is fast. Why is it slow? Corn, that's just the way corn is. Oh, wait, we don't want this to... We don't want to grow this in there in the animal pen necessarily, though, right? Okay, instead, let's grow it out here. Let's get rid of this. And here, let's put some corn... Misk caravan hitching spot. Nice. He's on his way back. We got a, an exotic goods trader from Assen. We just traded with those guys. Would I rather only eat rice or only eat corn? I would probably pick rice, honestly. As much as I like corn, and I do like corn. I really like corn. I think... Um, a guinea pig has self-tamed. Alright. Let's sell this guinea pig to them. 94 bucks. It's pretty good. Um, Giso, the horse... This animal is rideable. 
People in a caravan will ride the fastest avail available animals, improving the speed of the caravan as a whole. Caravan riding speed 160%. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. I got 456 bucks here. There's a social skill trainer here that I don't have enough money for. Fuck. Why didn't they have that on sale when I went over there? That's annoying. Fine, I'll give my I'll take my 94 bucks for my guinea pig and I'll be on my way. Oh, because the, it was already on its way here. I see he's almost back. Fuck me, man. Holy shit, Ultra Monka. What the hell? Did you did you like did you go down a water slide to get back? Think of all that world experience he just got. He's back. Holy shit balls. Okay, we're gonna give Nyquil here. He's got four intellectual. Wait, who's who's not got much to do? Ultra Monka cannot research yet. It has to be thirteen years old. I guess everybody's pretty busy, right? Everybody's got like quite a bit to do. Admiral Kiki cannot do the research, cannot be trusted to do the research for sure. All right, let's just give it to NyQuil 89. I know that he doesn't have a passion for learning or whatever, but what can you do? We need to get some research done. the hell is it? Where is he? He's in bed. Did you not drop the goods off? I don't see the goods. Have the goods been moved somewhere? Buy it now. Oh yeah, I can buy it now. We got the uh we got money now. Maybe just enough. Skill trainer intellectual. Skill trainer social. Do I do I really want to buy this skill trainer social? I guess we can use it to start converting people, right? Oh, in the pen. It's probably in the pen. Yeah, you're right. Okay, so Ramsey can take this. Nyquil. Oh, it's not there. That's here. Can take this. Okay, Ramsey. We're going to assign you as the moral guide. Nice. Okay. And... Shator's priest needs to wear a veil. So we're going to have to start crafting veils. down in there petit krungo you keep it down if it's a, it's such a shame we can't just like uh wheel her over here and have her look through these papers like uh, she's probably so bored in there Okay, let's get this installed so that we can keep it cooler in there for the baby. 
The baby's in the kitchen right now where it's cool. Alright, this ought to get it down. 20... 22 degrees? Admiral K Kiki's crying. Oh, look. Admiral Kiki's already learned how to cry himself to sleep. Uh-oh. We're getting uh, raided by the... The Poo-Ink Amalgamation. It's Dowie... <laughs> look at this... Look at this double act. It's like two fucking bank robbers. Oh, man, that's good. All right, good. Is this the end? Of Dowie and 99? Absolutely it is. Yeah, there's no way they're getting through. <coughs> It's it's like the two it's like the two guys from uh it's like the wet bandits from Home Alone. Look, they've got the they got the same uniform on and everything. Here they come. Ow, ow, ow. Yeah, no. D Dowie's out. And this is a normal machine pistol. Holy shit. 99 had 19 neutroamine on him as well. Incredible. Incredible. He's dead. He's dead. Yeah, once we, uh, once we can do some, um, okay, let's see if we can get him on some research now. He's got seven intellect. Uh, that's pretty good. He'll just be gaining some now, too. I know he's not got, like, a passion for it, but it's better than nothing, right? It's it's, it's the best we can do right now. <coughs> okay, Ultra Munka. Ramsey. Who is not part... Ultra Munka needs to be converted. Nice. Hey, look at how much f faster Ramsey is at uh, gardening now. All that, all that practicing has paid off. Okay, Ultra Monka, you're you're going again. By the way. This time we're going to send you on a horse. Uh, Ultra Monka, and we're going to send you on Giso. Very nice. It's going to take 0 0.8 days on horseback. And look at the mass as well, 104 kilograms. Insane. Okay, let's take all this neutroamine. We don't need it right now. Cloth, bird skin, um, light leather dog leather, lizard skin, plain leather, fox fur, guinea pig fur, steel, jade, plasteel, wooden bed normal? A wooden bed good? No, we better not. We're taking two beds. Ah, we don't need to sell these beds. Um, nine nine's body? A poor knife? A revolver? And then let's take some of these, um, let's take the cowboy hat. Actually, the t-shirt. The pants are apparently worth 146 bucks, but I doubt that. 
I doubt that. Travel supplies? No medicine? Four meals? Alright. We're just gonna sell some of this stuff. Ultra Monk is getting his horse ready. The horse is called Giso. Take all this stuff to sell it. Off he goes. <laughs> They're going. That was a real quick load up. Off they go in the rain at night. The best time to go. I didn't allocate him to ride it. Oh shit, I, I needed to do that? How do I do it now? Oh, he, he'll ride it automatically? Okay, good. Where is he going? He's gonna get attacked by a fox. No, he did not. Is it nice and cool in here? Yeah, it's nice and cool in here. Good temperature for sleeping. All right, chat. I feel like we're we're getting there. We've got a we've got a very defendable little corner here with uh, not too many. Um, we got well, we got a kid and a baby. Alexa played genuine pony. Watch his speed on the map. It's insane with a horse. Okay, he'll be waking up in a minute. Once it's morning time, he'll be off. Right? It's happening in a sec. Ride the horse. Yeah, look at that. It is pretty fast. Once it gets on the on the road, it must just go like zooming. <coughs> nice. Ah, I'd be there in no time. Ramsey eight and Nyquil eighty nine had a had a social fight. Uh oh. That's no good. That's no good. I think in here we want to auto cut not dandelions, but trees and stuff. Yes. He's almost there. He would have gone faster if he just stuck to the roads, you know? It looks like he's getting really bogged down in the mountains. He can't steer the, the horse well enough. Okay, the caravan arrived. <coughs> Rice. Berries, neutroamine, 254 bucks worth of stuff so far, 276 bucks worth of stuff. They got a crafting skill trainer, an intellectual, the kidney and lung that I sold them, they're now selling at a much higher price. Um, they still don't really have any weapons or anything. <laughs> Just take the money and run. We'll do a bigger. Uh, we'll do a bigger load up next time. All right. All right. Let's get him back. In the meantime. I gotta mine up some of this stuff. What's this? Oh, limestone. I need some components. I'm running a little low. I also uh, have to uh, get going in a minute. I gotta get. I gotta. I gotta head off in a minute. It's getting late. I could have bought components, yeah, or I can mine them for free, and come back with some silver and maybe use that to buy something else that I I need later. Look, there's plasteel down here, too. Holy crap. 
That's good. Oh, that's good. It's not actually that much compacted machinery here. There's a little bit, though. Maybe I can use it to buy more components at some point in time. You're right. Maybe I could. Maybe that's what I want to do. Sorry for betraying and killing the baby. Hey, don't worry about it. It happens. It's just one of those rib world things, you know? Oh. Where's Admiral Kiki? Right here, look in the baby crib. Admiral Kiki is already three months old. One quadrum. One quadrum. Oh, look at all the chem fuel we have, too. We have tons of it. And NyQuil89 is actually doing research. How is the research going? Not bad. He's gaining... He's got no passion, but he's doing his best, right? Am I streaming on the big day tomorrow? Um, Probably not in the day, no. I mean, I know it's a big day, but... It's not like a, it's not, we st I still have to do like a million dad things tomorrow. I'll try to catch the, um, the coronation though. They're back. They made it back with all this money. Oh, look at all that steel. Holy crap. It's the Kentucky Derby tomorrow? Wow. I've heard of that. I don't know what it is though. Um, yeah, I, I might. Uh, I might. If I get a chance, I'll. Uh, I'll watch it. I think my kids are doing some stuff for it. I think they are having like a. They had like a party at school and stuff today, for it. I don't know. We get. Uh, we get two days off next week off the back of it though. Monday we get a bank holiday and then Tuesday is a local um, liberation day. Is Tuesday. The day that Jersey was liberated from the uh, Nazis in World War II. Because it was occupied. So we get two. We get two, two, two days off in a row. Not bad, eh? Charles just keeps coming here to York and destroying the traffic. The day that... Paid volcanic winter for 17 days. Oh, God. Jeez, that's awful. No way. No, I am not doing that. You're right. All right. Saving and quitting. We did. Uh, we're, 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 this is a fun one so far. It's been fun. It's slow, but uh, but it's been pretty fun. We installed a couple of new mods. We lost the last colony. We'll carry on with this one and try to build into the mountain and see how it goes. And uh, and we'll try to uh, make ourselves um, some of some of the big like the the big thing that killed us last time was that toxic uh, fallout. It really screwed us over. It we we ran out of food. I thought we'd have enough food, but we did not have enough food. And then everybody had to death march across the map to a new location, and everybody starved. Oh, it was a toxic cloud of piss. So we lost the, we lost that run and we started a new one. And so far it's been action packed. We kidnapped a woman and who was pregnant and remo removed both of her legs. No, she tried to raid us while she was pregnant. She wasn't killed by the traps. So we removed both of her legs and forced her to give birth in jail and then stole her baby. I wish I was joking, but we did all those things. I, I know I, what a game, eh? So we're gonna raise the baby to become uh, one of us, and hopefully the baby does not turn around and betray us one day. Yeah. Well, she did raid us. I don't, you know, maybe she should have not raided us during her second trimester of pregnancy, you know? 
Anyway, um, <laughs> on that note, on that positive note, um, thanks so much for watching. <laughs> I hope you had fun. Um, I'll be back. Uh, I'll probably be back later tonight if you want to. If you want to play some more, I'll be around. Uh, if not, I'll probably be around in the evenings on the weekend. I'll try to be around on the weekend, but it's kind of busy on the weekend with kids and stuff. Um, and then I'll be back next week. I'm not sure what days. I think I'm doing a, a hashtag ad next week. I think I might be doing two hashtag ads next week, actually. Uh, but those will just be um, sort of sprinkled in on top of copious amounts of RimWorld. And then I think on Wednesday we're going to play some more Sea of Thieves with Ravs. I'll try to get like a, a, a regular slot or something once a week going where we can just hang out and play that and catch up and stuff. It'd be good. Rolling in the Ferrari money. Yeah, I know. I sold all my Ferraris. Replaced them with uh, downgrades. I got a whole bunch of Renault Clios. And now I've got this cool stackable automatic garage that I'm just going to put all my, my Renault cars in. It's going to be awesome. Just a million Renaults. Yeah. I like a Clio as well. I really do. All right, chat. Um, thanks so much for watching. Thanks for the support. I appreciate it. Thanks for the subs and resubs. Thanks for the donations. Um, take it easy. LOL. Lots of love. And I'll see you uh, later. All right? Okay. Bye now. Bye.